Okay, I think we are going. I think we are good. Hello, everyone, and welcome back. Okay, I panicked for a second because I, uh... Wow, I might actually be further along in this game than I thought. Uh, I was panicking for a moment because my save file was... It looked like it was missing, and I was like, Oh, no, that would be, like, the worst thing. All right, now I have to remember how to play this game. Right, okay. I haven't played this in... There we go. I haven't played this in like 10 days, and so it's going to take me a little bit of getting used to. Let me take a look at some stuff. Where the heck are we? Where the heck are we going? What are we doing? What is anything? Uh, let's see. It has been, it's been a little while. So what do we want to do? We've got the green area that we haven't gotten into. I don't think there's anything on the upper zone. Here's a question. Does this game have any steam guides yet? Yes. Okay, so I don't want to look too much. I just want to see if there's anything missing. Uh, so I'm currently in the red zone. We've got the full kind of forest green zone. There's the kind of murky zone. Quaff. Okay. So there's a murky, murky kind of ochre zone south, uh, south of the green and the red zone that we kind of... No, we haven't seen at all. There's some part of that gray zone that we haven't gone to. So actually looking at this map, there's a forest green zone that we've started... There's a blue zone that we looked at, an ochre zone, and a pink zone. And I think that might actually be it. So we might be uh, a lot further than, than I, uh, a lot further than I thought. It means to some degree I gotta figure out where I, where I am, where I'm going. I might go to the dark blue zone. There's, there's something, oh, my cursor doesn't show. There's a couple of doors in the dark blue zone that I haven't checked out yet. And so those might be the next place for me to go. We also might want to go find, um, uh, what is it? The, uh, the seer. Because she said go back after we get pieces of titania. And that's something that I've been, uh, neglecting to do this entire time. There we go. How's the audio? The game might have gotten... Yeah, seer's home. There we go. I think the game might have reset its audio. It might be a little loud. I'll just turn it down briefly. Uh, let's see. Music. Sound. Hit lag. Okay. Looks like I've just got all tap for this one. I've noticed some games recently have just been uh, resetting their sound settings on my computer, and I don't really know why. Okay. So, Seer should be down here. Yeah, here we go. Hello, Sia. Now scram. Okay, never mind. I guess we don't get cool things. Now here's a question. Is there like a super boost jump that I can do? Maybe not. Alright. Well, we've got a darkened zone directly below us. So that's kind of where I want to head. A rude seer. Yeah, no kidding. Ow. Let's see. Oops. Oh, wait, no. That's safe. <laughs> Cripes. And this... This is why I use cheat flight for getting around. Okay, here we go. You know, oddly enough, descending into Metroidvania is one of the hardest parts of the game. Okay, here we go. So we want to actually just go straight to the right and see what I can do over here. Oh, I guess I should use this briefly. There we go. So there was something directly to the right that I haven't done. Oh, excuse me. Whoa. I don't think you're supposed to be able to pop that guy into the air. Oh, uh, yeah. That's why I've never done this. Because I couldn't cross that gap before. I'm not entirely sure if what I'm doing is legal. But who's going to stop me, right? I don't think there's anything up above. I always got to check. Nope, most assuredly not. Wow, this freaking rocket launcher, man. is just bafflingly good. So what do we have? What do we have up here? This whole area is new to me. And probably not somewhere I'm supposed to be. Hello, Changeling. Do you want to play a game? You're honored by the Fae to be our foremost spy in the Coalition. 
They say you're strong and fast, but how powerful can a changeling be? If you want, I can show you a few treasures of mine, but you'll have to pass my challenge first. Oh no, not another one of these. All right. Nope. One second. Ow. Okay. How do I how do I heal again? That's how I heal. All right. Because I can pretty much... Bugger. I can pretty much use these boost pads to go wicked high. Uh... Huh. There we go. Alright, I got it. Nope, that didn't work. Yeah, sometimes it just doesn't... Sometimes it doesn't wanna. Which is a slight frustration. There we go. Unfortunately... I'm supposed to boost at some point. There we go. Nope, didn't work. Oh, I see how I'm supposed to do this. All right, this is pain. This, uh, these challenge, f oh, right. Oh, man. All right, whatever. Let's try again. Or, no, hold up. We want to do that. Because that gets us... Convenient boosts. Yeah, didn't get it. Oh, I have to jump, then shoot. Oh. Oh, come on. I didn't let loose. Got it. Heal. Got him. All right, much smoother. Oop. There we go. All right, heal a bit. Get rid of him. Nope. Oh, I made it. launch. Wait, a battle room? I don't have time for this. I think I was right at the end, too. Alright. Nope. Nope. Gotta be from here? Nope.
Nope. There we go. It's over here. Nope, didn't work. Damn. It's like... Nope. Take it. Got it. Nope. Oh, please. Good. It didn't launch me somewhere stupid. Oh. And I could have actually just gone from here. Up. Oh, destroy him. Battle room. Unfortunately, we're still in about the same space. Oh, ugh, come on. Please be right at the end. Another battle room? I... Holy smokes. This is, uh... This is challenging. Right from the get-go. Unfortunately, I'm... Almost wondering if I'm missing, like, a tool. Ah, shoot. I always forget this one. There we go. I just have to make sure I make no mistakes here. I, mm. There we go. Don't get slowed down. Hey, that worked even better. your death. Better to do that than fall elsewhere. Okay, so we've got like 30 seconds on where we were at, which is good. Onwards. Oh. Alright, there we go. Way more time than where we're at. Alright, first one's on the left. Then it's just you. Then we're up here. Oh, I see it. Oh. Why am I... Why am I... Not hooking that. How am I supposed to get that gap? Oh, and it's like right at the end. That's got to be it. Unfortunately, I have oh, I have no idea how I'm supposed to do half of this junk. Sometimes I can pull it off. Sometimes I cannot. There we go. At least I'm getting reasonably good at some of these parts. 
Rude. There we go. No, come on. Oh. No, go down. Ah. That's, that's the trick. All right, back in, heal here. One, two, onwards. I lost so much time. Ow. Yeah, let's just try this one over. Grappling, never heard of her. This is faster. The only problem is I'm a little accident prone. There we go. Yet, sometimes I don't do the rocket jump. Like, she just doesn't fire. I don't know. It might be a timing thing. And sometimes I bonk my head. Which is embarrassing. But whatever. There we go. Alright, much better. It's just that last section that I don't know what to do about. I'll take it. Wasn't really supposed to go that direction, but it's fine. Unfortunately, I'm losing some time because I'm not very good at memorizing the whole route. Oh. Wow. With like 24 seconds to s spare. So are we becoming the TF2 soldier now? Oh, we've just been the TF2 soldier this entire time. Past your challenge. Now you said you had treasure? Ha ha ha. Yes, my stash is just up ahead. You may want to watch your step. Like any good trove, it has a bit of a dragon problem. Er. Oh, I see. Fine. Works. You cannot stop me. Yep. Okay, I don't know where I'm going. I guess I'm going over here. Uh, let's see. Is this the demo? No, this... Wait. Demo? Okay, so I think what I need to do... Oh, I see. Nope. Hmm. Oh, I'm gonna just die here, aren't I? I should probably heal. No, that ain't gonna work. Hmm. Alright, and we're good. I have to say, the mountain side is so much more my vibe. Hi, Bonnie, what are you doing here? With you going to bring Titania back, I thought I'd arrange a tea party to celebrate. I'm looking for guests to invite. Count me in. Mm, I'll get back to you. Anyways, one of the guests I want to invite is in the other room. Help me invite him. I'm just so glad that there's a save statue and a teleporter here. Okay, this other room? Okay. Let's go the other direction. This is a whole thing? <gasps> Why is there more? Why is there so much more? 
I... Bit of a dragon problem, she says. That, oh. Ow. Pestilence, they say. Yeah, so I think I'm gonna have to... Fly over him for that section. Fine. Slightly un unfortunate here. No, what? Oh, that was a different one. Okay, that that's that stuff again. Ow. Rude. Is it dead? Or do we have another face? Well, we got some helicopters. Oh, and we're good. Ah, I'm free. Uh, thanks, I guess. Do you want a reward or something? Well, I don't have anything. Tough luck. Rude. Well, what do we have over here? Hey, a memory upgrade. I'll take it. You passed the platforming challenge. Your reward, another platforming challenge. <gasps> I'm actually, like, doing reasonably well here. I was expecting to be having a worse time. Ah, uh, well, now I've got some more memory space. I have nothing. All right. So where are we going? I guess we have two platforming challenge rooms. Oh. Wait, how the hell? Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna turn the game speed down by like an amount. I think this is a reflex thing that I'm There we go. I just needed some more space Or some more space some more time to actually get it done uh, And let's put this back up to 100% I don't need anything like flight or invincibility This one ter terrifies me as well Oh, there's a whole thing up there. <laughs> okay, I, yeah, I just have to get high enough. There we go, got it. Is that it, though? Is it just money? Oh, I was hoping for, like, a trinket or something. Well, I think we're done with this entire area. Looks like the purple zone is... Fully complete. Oh, and you can see the uh, challenge zone over there. So I, I guess we're good. Whoops, wrong direction. Where are we? Where are we going with this nonsense? Because we could go to the green zone, but I, I, I should probably go in the correct direction, which I think is actually from the bottom. Because I think it was the pipe. Let's let's actually do this zone cor correctly as opposed to, you know, sequence breaking it like the goon that I am. So I'm pretty sure I don't have enough fairy silver for her. Let's see. I have three. I guess I should go back to platforming normally, occasionally. Okay, so this is where we got the grappling hook. And then you go in through the door. And then here's the tutorial. Hi again, seems like you got a nice upgrade. Down when the grappling hook to get a boost. There we go. Just to actually learn how to do it. Because I've been maybe a little over-reliant on the ro rocket launcher for letting me skip things. 
and might be a good idea for me to actually learn. I miss this much. The map is huge. Uh, yeah. So we actually only have a couple regions left. We have two down south here, a little bit more in that gray zone. See how there's that like one ochre nib? Uh, so that's part of one of the two lower zones. And then there's this whole blue zone here. And then whatever's left in this green zone that I haven't done. And then I think we're actually good. Uh, it looks like we've got three titania parts left. And we only have one flag left, which I think I'm actually just going to go do now. But I could be wrong. Wasn't there a dude here? Or maybe he's up above. I forget. Yeah, he was over here. Being a shopkeeper is fun. Humans are so generous with their gifts. A human gave me some trinkets in exchange for my blessing. I granted her her heart's desire. Can I see the trinkets? No, I'm using them right now. But if you finish my challenge course, I'll give you one for free. How about it? Want to try try ugh, try to climb a wall really fast? It's pretty fun. Yes. Okay. Oh. Uh. One second. Oh, thank you, frame rate. Yeah, let's try that again. Fine. In which direction am I supposed to go here? Left or right? Maybe it doesn't matter. Now let's see if this is harder. We've got the hooks there. Guess I'm going this direction? Oh boy. I, she just didn't feel like grabbing it. I've got to remember, I also have the plant boost jump. There we go. Which I can actually use to gain a fair bit of height. Yeah, we do. Oh. There we go. I ain't making it. I'm making it. <gasps> Second try. Hey, you actually did it. How's this for a reward? What what did I get? Uh, let's say no. I have no idea what I got it. Uh, got, but I got it. And that is not all of the flags. So there's still one more zone at the very least. Wait, hold up. Oh, now I can just go through this direction. That's what I got. Okay, so that area is done. Continue on. Yeah, room to the left. I, I'm not quite used to being able to revisit those those rooms. Okay, I'm going up. And then this was a battle room, but I already cleared it. Aha! You cannot get me. I am too jumpy for you. Well, okay, one of them got me, but it's fine. I just want to go through this correctly, just in case I miss anything. Ow, rude. You found the rocket launcher. Cool stuff. The rocket launcher is hilarious. Yeah, I'll just take the damage. 
because we've got that right there. So is this a Metroidvania designed for a keyboard and mouse? Yes. I think you can play with a controller, but like, oh, I don't, I don't know if I would want to. I'm sure it's doable and I'm sure the developers have tested it, but from my own perspective, like this is way more fun uh, with keyboard and mouse and also like way more flexible. Where does this go? A couple of bells. Is it so bungee? Whatever this is. Oh. It connects to that red room. Interesting. Yeah, it is a puzzle. It's not like, um, how did I, how do I swap weapons? There we go. It seems to be get them all to ring. Do the room before was a hint. I don't think so. Yeah, the hint is very far away from here. All right. It's supposedly the shotgun is as good as the sniper. Really? I don't know. It feels like the rocket launcher. I think the rocket launcher is a little bit more. And we have more foes. Yeah, so I'll have to keep an eye out for the bell room. Yell if you guys see the clue, because I'm liable to just miss it. Okay, there we go. Heal up. Ow. Rude. Okay, we're done. We're done. Good. That hurt. Okay, we've been there before, so we don't need to worry about it. We've got a gate. Okay. If you jump and double tap, I guarantee it gives a small amount more power. Main advantage, it's a boost when not next to a surface. Oh. But am I going back down? Oh, I am. There we go. <laughs> there we go. It takes a little bit more effort. But there's something over here. Jose! Hmm. Sniper? No. Sniper rifle will not. Oh, wait, I know. I know what will. Oh, rude. Okay, 
There we go. I see. So it's a trap. Very much a... Uh, well, I'm not getting through that direction. That's a pain. Do you actually have something else on the other side? Go here. Oh, good. Thank biscuits for mana. Okay, so where are we? Yeah, let's keep going this direction. Wherever it leads... I just want to fill in the map. Ow. That sucks. Oh, no. Do I have to do, redo all of that? I do. It's sucks. I'm a huge proponent of per room checkpoints. There we go. At least that went sma faster. But yeah, those shotgun fairies do really do quite a lot of damage. There we go. Get out of the way. I could just fly. I could, but why? Okay, let's heal back up again. There we go. There we go. All right, let's heal up. And we had a mana pad right here, yeah? Perfect. Yeah, I'm trying to conserve flying mostly as a time-saving measure rather than anything else. Oh, wait, really? How the devil are you sub supposed to make this crossing? Yeah, you have to ledge grab the other side, correct? And then fire yourself up and over? Ugh. how you're supposed to do this? Alright, we should probably heal up. 
Like this, this might actually be one of those where I, I give up. Like I, oh, the timing on this one. Actually, you know what? There was an answer. Just 80% speed. Nope. 80% speed can't save me when I miss. How the hell are you supposed to catch these micro ledges? If there weren't spikes on the top, this would be doable. Because unless there's like another another power I don't know about. There we go. Oh, okay, so there's silver up there. It's worth it. Giant pain in the butt, though. Ah. Oh, come on. He just shot upwards. Probably because my cursor was in the wrong spot, I'm sure. Nah. There we go. Could use the rocket. Rocket doesn't really work that well here. Rocket works great if there's a surface nearby. Ah. I want that face silver, but boy, howdy, man. Let's see, is the pillar not a surface? Not. Not easily, no. Wow. I actually might it might just be able to I might actually just be able to do this. Yeah, I'm supposed to shoot like right at right at the bottom. Dang it. I've always wondered if you can specifically stand like it feels like you might actually be able to stand on the edge of that you get like a hot second where you might be able to nope that didn't work You can double dip with a shotgun. Once you're on the right side, shotgun after jumping off the ledge to go higher. Then, shotgun again at the apex, apex of the downswing to go back up. Oh, boy. I gotta, I gotta wonder 
was was this the intended way of solving this? Because oh boy, missed it. This is, uh, grueling. I don't know. Okay, I'm just gonna go invin- or er, invincible. There's no reason for me not to be invincible here. That didn't work. Nope, that also didn't work. Celeste has spike jumps. Maybe they have something similar? Not to my knowledge. It's good to know that being invulnerable does not make... ...this part trivial. It'd be kind of tacky if I could actually stand... Yeah, the problem is... Disconnecting the uh, grappling hook is shockingly hard sometimes. Ooh. No. Let's go pure f slow mode. Oh, and of course, as usual. Not actually sure if I use the boost. This is almost harder. I'm less oh you know how I said I think there is in fact a tiny ledge Is a singular pixel. Yeah. I don't know. I don't think I can do the reflexes on this one. I think I'm gonna have to throw in the towel. Yeah, so now I rocket jump. Maybe. I just want to see if I can find that magic pixel on the other side. I don't think I'm going to. Yeah, I don't know how I got it that time. But yeah, I'm gonna throw in the towel. There's only so much before I'm like, okay, this is, I'm spending too much time on a thing that I cannot do. Yoink. I don't know. I know it's about momentum and a bunch of other things, but like, I'm not that good at these things. It's, it's too many steps and it's thrown me off. I wish I was that good. And it's like, I'm almost there, and I probably could get it with enough time and effort, but, uh... Eh. I'm still on the shotgun, aren't I? Where's my buddy? Where's my rocket boy? 
All right, no collision damage. Yeah, those worms tricked me. Got so used to the enemies that actually do collision damage that I'm not used to them not. But yeah, my main beef mostly boils down to, I would actually like to finish this game within a s session or two. Uh, they really? Whatever, it's fine. Uh, but because I would like to finish this game within a session or two, there's kind of that aspect of just like, I don't want to get too bogged down on like one or two challenge fights. It'd be great if I could. I'm just not that good. So actually looking at this, we've cleared out the green area. Is it just a transition area zone? Because yeah, I've done, I've done this. There was that one upper room, which we did. Yeah. Oh. I think I know how I'm supposed to do that one. Why are these sections so heinous? There we go. Okay. I just wanted to get that correct. From the left room? Now it doesn't connect. That is absolutely how you're supposed to do that one. just don't know how you're supposed to catch those guys because there's no grappling hook locations either pa past the lab part of the game Shoot the thing uh what the enemy Yeah, you can hook enemies, which was what I was trying to do. But... Yet, yeah, I'm too heavy. supposed to do that one I know you can hook enemies but I'm I'm so heavy that I try and like hook and go off of them and instead I just fling them into the ether and I've got to do it twice in a row okay you're you suck nope I don't think they have a... Yeah, 
its shotgun shenanigans. Ugh. Okay. Oh, yeah, you weren't kidding. It really is shotgun shenanigans. All right. Yeah, I was assuming I'd have to hook off of those enemies, but... Yeah, I needed the, uh, just lateral speed. Alright, I guess we're going up and over, or... Dealing with you. Oh, right. Ow. Rude. There we go. But yeah, I was assuming since there are enemies there, I was supposed to grapple through. But that is very clearly not the case. Alright, so we've done everything here, so I guess we go over to the right now. Rude. There we go. We have the lasers. Do we have anything else? Well, we do have a fast travel point. And is this the way I came in? I have no idea. I think I got the lore. Farewell. Alright. They're dead. Where am I going? Did I get the lore on this room? I think I did. Humans are so fun. Okay. Oh, it was 50 years. Yeah, we did that one. Alright, so I guess next order of business. We want to head over here. Not get blasted too much. There we go. Doors open! Finally. I still haven't found any kind of boss for this region. It might just be a transitional zone. But, we still have a little bit left. Oh. Wait, no, we can go up here. Ow. Rude. Oh. Very rude. Okay, and then we've got hook time. Ow. Oh. This is bad. I guess if I hooked over them, maybe it wouldn't be so bad. Nope, that actually was not as bad as it could have been. Now let's go down. Get a mana pad. Nope. Ow. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> oh. Come on. Give me a second. We're just gonna turn on invincibility. No reason to go back. There we go. Yeah, the shotgun really does give that lateral burst of speed that we need. And that might actually be a thing. Let's go heal. Prefer the rocket launcher for fights, though. Right. And invincibility. Turn it off. So do we... We do have another boss fight in here. This dear sweet sister. 
Last chance, Fern. Turn back now. This is just the natural order of things, Maya. Magic comes in cycles, and manca mankind has had its time in the sun. I can't accept that. The world you described is one that mankind can never live in. Maybe you don't understand, but humanity is mortal. We are fragile. But they can afford the age of Fey, or can afford to enjoy the age of Fey when it comes to when it comes and patiently wait for the age of men to in to end whenever it is humanity's turn to rule. But how many children will have to grow up afraid of the Fey? I know that their entire lifespan will never, in their entire lifespan, they will never see a world where humans are safe. Well, I don't make the rules. This is just what the world is like. In fact, the age of men has already lasted twice as long as it should have. Have you ever thought we could make a world? the world a kinder place? I don't care about the world. It's never been kind to me. Have I? Did I hurt you? I always tried to be a good sister. I wasn't talking about you. No matter how much time passes, there's a grudge I can't let go. It's time for the gates to open and let out, let us out of Elf Flame. Oh boy. She's there. Okay. Dang it. She's there and she hurts. Let's heal back up again. Yeah, it's those saw blade shots. Oh, they're homing. fast and I don't have the health to cope with that. Good time to use a heal. Okay, just stay careful. Okay, you swapped that boss. Oh, damn it. Yeah, this the piercing saw blades get homing. Which is uh, a little rough. And I don't even know. Oh! Why do I have my shotgun out? It's not a huge amount of homing. I'm just gonna wait. Her cycle is weird. I don't like it. Okay, lucky me. Ah, ha, ha. Yeah, you can't outrange those. She's just alternating between. Well, I'm dead. Damn! That didn't work. Nope. Okay. Yeah, you pretty much can't let her get you with the saw blades on the diagonal. At least not comfortably. I 
And it might be a good idea for me to play Ring Around the Rosie, like, much more closely. As far as I know, we... She doesn't do contact damage. Damn it. Nope. Uh, I mean, I have some other options. The thing is, this is a terrible idea. Like, the damage is good, don't get me wrong. I should have gotten out of there. Especially because her damage is too dang good. She pops up for just one of those shots. Let's just try that again. Let's, um... Yeah, the sniper damage is solid. The problem is... Uh, the sniper damage is solid, but it locks me in place for too long. And then also... Uh... Come on. We might want to just leave this. She's hard. I know I can beat her. I think my best bet, though, truly is what I was doing earlier. Well, except for this. Because I can effectively bait her into a ranged fight. Which is mostly fine. It gives me the maximum potential to both hit her and dodge. Come on! I yeah, think if the saw blades didn't home in, none of it would be a problem. There we go. Oh, that was close. Ow. Okay. Nope, that ain't it. Uh, my sister exploded. It's too late, Maya. I know who you're looking for, but you'll never find the beloved child. Stop fighting and just accept it. Don't tell me what to do. You're not the sister I knew. You're one of them. You've been trying to tell me that this whole time, and you're right. Goodbye, Fern. Piece of Titania. Good sister. Yeah, I feel kind of bad. So what do we have up here? Uh, what is this? Bolt Dispenser. Okay. Oh, that's got one hell of a cooldown. And then we're back here. So I think that's it for the... Almost it for the green zone. It does, in fact, dispense bolts. You are not kidding.
week. Bear was call calling. Okay, so now we're down in that ochre area I was talking about. All right. Hate to do this though, but I'm actually gonna be right back. I'm back I just going through the last couple of fights is like oh yeah I really need to be here what do the Fae do with kidnapped children anyway wouldn't you know uh I don't remember they give them candy I guess basically everything they want they get sometimes you play in Titania's court visit gleaming meadows filled with sunbeams and Fae creatures but don't they miss their human family nope I think she's just projecting a bit Okay, I don't think I can kill that thing. Also... How the hell am I supposed to get up there? Oh, am I supposed to... You can grab... Oh, no! Oh, no, thank you! I don't know what you are. Well, that hurt. Okay, let's switch back to the rocket launcher and save. Well, that didn't help. What? What was that? Oh, they, those slow you down a lot. Is that it? Just to go back? How am I supposed to kill that thing? Seems really durable. I guess kind of use line of sight against it, but Oh. Oh, that's stunningly rude. Children beware the changeling king. It'll take you to his gloomy fiefdom in the kingdom of his cruel queen, where you shall sup upon sweets and syrup till your teeth all rot. Okay. I kind of have to go back through, even if I don't want to. Just to get this unlocked on the map. I don't think there's anything left there for me to actually do. Which is nice. Oh, but let's hope there are not many of those.
because I'm not quite ready to deal with. Jerk spiders. Die. Well, this sucks. Bullets do extra damage over time. Let's get rid of that. I can water later. Yeah. Money tracks towards you. I honestly might just get rid of that. Let's see extra damage. Nah. You know, I forgot I had a grenade. Yeah, my problem is I actually don't... I guess I'll grab Thorny Rose. I don't actually have a whole lot of damage upgrades at the moment. Which is kind of an interesting issue. Okay, so why don't we... What? Oh! Okay, there we go. Rude, dude. Chillins. One night we found the lords and ladies all dancing wildly in the forest. With their laughter, they invited us to join the fray. We stepped in their circle and danced all night, unable to stop to our dismay. They took us to Fair Elf Flame, where we've, where we've since stayed. We ate their food and danced and played. Soon we found our skin turn tinged green, a side effect of the cuisine. We came out of that land with some older, some other fae, since the age of men is giving way. Now we remember our lives from before, and oh, our past was such a bore. As we eat human food and breathe this new air, we shall soon be back to how we once were. And life in fair elf flame is seeming more like a blur. Even humans get changed by elf flame if they're in there too long. Most of the humans there got there by accident or were kidnapped by fairy, by a fairy. Some, though some were given. Some humans gave butter to the fae, and some humans gave their family. Yeah, so I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure. I mean, it's it's a pretty much absolute. Uh oh, I ain't gonna work. That didn't work. I'm pretty sure our uh, resentment... Oh, boy. Our resentment over what's going on. A considerable portion of that... See, uh, might be because she actually was just abandoned. I wish there's a better tell. I guess they start glowing. There we go. Oh, nothing else. The hell clod... Clod chunker is this thing. The problem is every time I do that, I'm pretty sure it resets this thing's health. Well, whatever. Don't care. Alternatively, maybe I have a weapon for this. Well, I killed it. It hurt me dearly, but it's dead. Okay, and then we're just back here. Nothing else fancy. It's, uh... This area's hard. Good to see you, Changeling. I can feel the power of the pieces you carry. Give them to me and I can bring back your precious queen. 
I don't have all the pieces of Titania yet. No, but we don't need them all. It's not her body that's important, but her spirit. If you have enough pieces, I can use that power to bring her spirit back. Actually, I'm going to hang on to the pieces for now. Huh. I suppose you still lack sufficient pieces. One more piece is in Elflame, our beloved home. Down in the Barrow's ceiling, the door of Elflame awaits. Ask her the password of the door. Listen closely. It goes 31424. Now I suggest you hurry and visit the final piece soon. Uh, we might actually want to head for the lab. Because we've got a couple of zones that we haven't been to yet. I'm still shocked I haven't found more power-ups. Let's see. So what else do we have? We've got a little bit in the green zone. Uh, or not the green zone. The, uh, the red zone that we haven't done yet. That I guess I kind of skipped out on. And we've got a little bit in the gray. Is there more movement tech that I've got? Uh, that I still have to up unlock? Or is this, like, pretty close to it? Because it feels like... This is annoying. Okay, let's do another one. Okay. Tech, but it doesn't make a big difference. It's very minor. Interesting. Oh, we got that. Uh, let's see. Anything in here? Oh, no. Close enough. That hurt, though. Guess I should probably go back up to 100% speed. Okay. Well, got a shortcut open. Where are we? Yeah, I guess we're just kind of looping back and forth, kind of like what we were. Oh, boy. Got it. Yeah, looping back and forth like we were in the um, green zone, interestingly enough. This also feels like another... Hmm. I mean, this sucks. Oh, and it's a combat room. How did I not take damage? 
How am I not taking damage from this? I think that other one's broken. All right. We do not think about what just happened there. We just accept that it happened and we are thankful for it. I guess I'm gonna heal a bunch. I don't know where my UI went. I don't... I don't even know how you're supposed to slingshot this one. Because there's like zero headspace for it. I'm close to the UI, so it's transparent. Yeah, it's true. Yeah, pure slingshot energy, one side to the other. Oh. Yeah, but it always drags me down. I guess I'm just going to go invincible for this one. I don't... The problem is I don't have a good reference for how the hell you're supposed to do this. Most games kind of tutorialize these things by showing it to you beforehand, but this one's just like, hey, good luck. Here's a pad. understand now. Alright, let's turn invincibility back off. Now it doesn't look like there's anything there. Yeah, let's go save. Okay, and then we've got these two side chambers here that I haven't been into. But... I am actually beyond baffled. Ugh. Because I'm going to turn on invincibility too. Holy smokes. Whole game turned up to dang near 11. Oh. I guess this works. Oh, there's our backpack upgrade. Oh, good. All right, let's go take a look at the other side without changing any of our settings. Oh, you know, we've been here. It's down one that we haven't done. This is uh, some serious fresh hell that I found myself in. Can I get Jerk Sister back? At least I feel like I have a shot. Well, I'm going to turn that invincibility back on because boy, do I need it.
Oh, I hit the magic pix pixel again. I can really arrest my movement whenever I want, which is kind of nice. Oh. Puck, why do you have such garbage range? Stretch farther. I see how I'm supposed to do this one. It's hard. I don't know. 50%, I guess. Yeah, see, I think I need to be low. I... Nope. Oh. Oh, so the trick is I'm not supposed to jump at all. Because it takes me on a very clean arc backwards. Wow. I was overdoing it. Okay, maybe not there. Maybe this one I have to jump. Or maybe I just have to be closer. Oh, the only immediate problem is on 50% speed. I have to wait that much longer. At least we should have enough face over now for another damage upgrade. so much harder. Oh, come on. Okay, let's go up to 60%. <laughs> okay, if I move over just a little bit more. I guess it's not that. It's more I just gotta let loose sooner. To the second platform. What second platform? Everything is spike balls. I pretty much can't kill my momentum either. I could always fly back, but I do kind of want to do this right. This is part of the challenge. Yes! Alright. 
So now that we're out of that fresh hell, we've got this... Yeah, we've got this entire section done. And she wants us to go down. I think we're going to go check out the lab. Actually, why don't we... Why don't we go here? Let's go to that one section that I hadn't been been to yet. Because we had this whole thing. Which I had originally poo-pooed because I didn't feel like I was supposed to be here yet. But now it's clear I maybe need to be. Oh. Trinkets. Balls. Well, you know what? Time to become invincible and just... Gusto. Oh. That sucks. That super sucks. Invincibility makes it so I can't get Ikered. I guess we'll just do infinite MP while I go through this. Err. Oh, I see. Got it. And there's the infinite mana pad. Oh, it's a... It's the last of the... Last of these. Got it. Got the flag. Oh, that's it. What about that one red door? All right, time to turn on flying. We're going to do a little bit of backtracking before I do anything else. Because there's one door kind of just above where I'm at that I don't actually... Oops. I don't actually know how to get that one. Hey, nice to know we've got all the flags in the game. Oops. Can I go further up? It's implying that there is a way up here. Oh, it's here. I'm just... It's it dark. Those really are some great accessibility settings. They're super good. I, got it. I don't think I would have made it this far without them. I think I could have, but the game would have pissed me off. And it would have stopped. I don't finish a whole lot of Metroidvanias anymore because they're really hard. And like, I get it. They're supposed to be hard. Their Metroidvanias, but on the flip side, I don't know. I I don't I want to be challenged. I don't want to be angry. Dude, there's a flag door. Have I found it? Not yet. Huh. Okay, so there's a shortcut door there. I thought it was limited on the green side. But yeah, being able to become invincible, uh, fly, and have infinite mana at will has been just such a boon for getting around and, like, finding things. And backtracking especially. Because instead of, um, instead of being in this situation where I'm constantly kind of frustrated. Because I have to redo stuff that I've already done before. This way I can instead just zip through really fast and not have to worry about any of my limitations. It's stopping me. Oh, it's the bells. It's the dang bells. Wait. What was the what was the passcode?
three, one, four, two, four. Yeah, it sounds about right. The screenshot cannot be loaded. What? I, I took a screenshot of the game, right? No, I did not. Well, that's unfortunate. Okay, so... Yeah, it's probably not. That's unfortunate. Okay, what else do we have? Because yeah, the green... Oh, no, we're not done with the green area. There's two doors I haven't been through. Man, somebody was probably upset about that. Because yeah, we have this whole... Both sides of this. Hello? Head? Queen Titania. Not exactly, it's another piece of her. It's just her head. My queen, I swear I'll unite your pieces and restore you to power. She's so drained of magic, she cannot speak. So are you gonna take the head? I can't, it's stuck to the altar by some kind of spell. Let's come back later if we have any ideas. Oh. Talking about the password you got from the Fey girl or the girl who lost her identity. Oh. Oh no. Mm. Oof. All right, invincibility on, flying off. Now actually that wasn't too bad. Hey. All right. Now we're done for realsies with the green area and don't have anything else. Aw. Wait, why do I have the sniper rifle? I have no idea. Let's go save. Yeah, so we'll just have to keep an eye out for the password. For the bell. Uh. Every time I see that, I think Krillin. I can't be the only one. Okay, so let's... Check the map. So the red area is done, with the exception of that one, that one door that I can't open up because bells. We're done with the purple zone. We're done with the turquoise zone. We've got a little bit left in the gray and a little bit left in the ochre, and then whatever is left in the blue. So I guess let's go for the blue. Let's see about the. Oh no 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 no! I need to go back. I need to go back. Is that it? Yeah. We want to go back to the pipe because I got some money to spend. Upgrade gun. Seven silver. Oh, and apparently there's still an item I'm missing here. All right. Yeah, creepy figure, fey girl is giving you the password for the bells below her. And I was hoping that it would also apply to the more distant bells. Because why not, right? Alright, time to do the lab. I don't have an accessibility settings on, right? Yeah, cool. So where are we going? I don't know. I guess I'm just going to go not this direction. I know when I'm unwelcome. Ugh. Huh. That fresh hell. Nope. Okay. 
Okay, then. So this is a no-go. Let's skip. Let's not go through that yet. We got that. Yeah, it looks like we have to go up. Okay. Ow, really? Oh, there it is. Yeah, I'm just gonna give myself infinite MP. I don't want to go back. I gain nothing from going back. Oh, you're right. Grenades can hurt them. Why do grenades... There we go. Anything over here? No, it doesn't look like it. There's whatever that is. Money? Oop. Worth it. I'm just gonna start lobbing grenades. You know what I miss most about the lab? You miss this place? One of the scientists would keep this mystery podcast running between experiments. Now we'll never know what happens next. Poor you. Go up. Money. There we go. Don't think there's much I can do about this. Yeah, I guess I'm just going to keep blasting them. That stone statue is locked behind that barrier. There's a switch somewhere that should disable it. It also looks broken. Okay, doesn't look like we have anything else. That worked. Unfortunately, uh, it's going to cost me... Hello. Notes on subject 1595 part 1. Subject was transferred to lab following failed interrogation. It had a bad reaction to the electroconvulsive protocol leading to memory loss. Oh well. I doubt a little Faye, Faye thing would have much to tell us anyway. Notes on subject 1595 part 2. Preliminary scans of subject are complete. Readings do not match other fairies we captured. For now, due to its appearance, we have designated the subject as a puck. This is the only part of the lab I've been around. The Coalition kept me here for experiments. After you freed me, I, you didn't exactly show me around. That would have been too dangerous. Even when you were disguised as my shadow, Maya nearly caught us. Huh. <laughs> Guess stealth isn't our strong suit. Sorry you had to come back here. No, I like being, being here and knowing you destroyed it all. The lab, the experiments, the scientists remember feeling panicked when the only thing I could remember was being trapped here and being experimented on. The worst part was wondering what my life was like before. Have your memories started coming back? That's not a good sign.
Okay. Yeah, oh, shit looks goopy. Oh, that gets us mana. That's what that thing is. So this was your prison. How long were you trapped here for? Oh, it's hard to say. I wasn't conscious much. Except somebody kept waking me up. You kept tapping on the glass. You kept tapping on the glass like an aquarium. I think you'd make a very nice puffer fish. There we go. Another mana glooper. Gotta save some of that, though, in case we have more... Uh, oh. Oh, this is rude. Oh, that... That sucks. Alright. Give me a second. I don't want to do that again. You often stream at this time. I don't have a schedule yet. I would like to have one. Um, but I, so I will admit one of my problems with trying to find a good live, live stream time uh, that I've run into is I'm not, I'm not quite sure how many people will show up based on the game I play and how many people will show up based on um, like what time it is. And so I, uh, I've been kind of iffy about specifically picking a schedule at the moment. Just because, I mean, having a schedule has been, uh, or having, not having a schedule for a little while has actually been really good for me. Uh, just in terms of, like, convenience. Because I pretty much could just relax and play things when I want, whenever I want. That said, it does seem like having an actual scheduled time wouldn't be a bad idea. Uh, all right. We want to go over here. I just want to make sure I don't miss any of these dialogue things while coming back through. All right. And then it's a fight room. Sort of. Ow. There we go. Anything else? New. No. Okay, prison. Kept tapping on the glass. Go over here. Alright, so accessibility. I'm going to leave infinite MP on. Alright. I don't know how you're supposed to do that cleanly. But that ain't it. Ugh, never liked this painting. Feels like her eyes are staring into my soul. That's Mary. She was the witch in charge of the lab. I heard she painted these portraits herself. Staff were forbidden to cover them up or take them down. What do you think her witch power is? Laser eyes? It's rude to speak about someone who's here. Ah! I love a good scare. I uh, bet we're gonna have to fight her. Gotta thread the... Thread the needle, it's hard. Yeah, no kidding. Alright. Yeah, I guess we're just gonna lob grenades down the line. Uh, well, I have just enough juice for that. That barrier should be down now. Ugh, what a pain. Hope there won't be more of these. I got some bad news for you. Seriously, why are we back here again? Let's just focus on the Sears mission. There's nothing for us here. You never know. It might be worth checking out. I hate how stubborn you are. Notes on subject 1595, part 3. We've begun the ichor extraction process. Subject's ichor is a purer grade than any we've seen before. It's almost like, no, it can't be. Upon further investigation, I've determined that the source of the ichor is not the subject's own magic. No, this puck is under a curse more powerful than we've ever seen. What are you looking at? Uh, nothing? 
I feel like this is going to be one of those situations where we find out that Puck is the real villain all, all along, and oh boy, uh, he's a stinker of a secret last boss. That statue's kind of messed up, isn't it? Sucks a little bit for me. Oh, why are we back here? This is the heart of the coalition. We might be able to scavenge something useful. And maybe there are other Fae here that we can rescue. Remember our mission. We need to give the pieces to the seer for Titania's return. We can't get distracted. Unless, of course, this is Oberon or something. Could be. Unless this one doesn't have an Oberon. Could be. I wonder if there's a trinket that specifically gives me mana back. The podcasts were right. The culprit always returns to the scene of the crime. No spoilers. Hey, it's a grenade door. I haven't seen one of these since, like, forever. How's it going? You know, I don't remember you being quite so cheery in person. Leading the coalition is a messy business. We have to do awful things to survive. I'm part of the Mary that she locked away so she could do what she needed to. All humans are evil, it comes naturally to them. Even a parent will betray their own child if it benefits them. Family means nothing. You starve a dog and put it in a cage and it bites you. Would you call the dog evil? Of course not, dogs are the best. You don't judge a caged dog. You shouldn't judge a human. Let's just keep going this direction for now. That didn't work. Heal up. Shoot. Oh. Ow. Fine. Oh, never mind. Not fine. Can't go that direction. There we go. It looks really fun. Wish there was enough money to buy all the games that were fun. Wish there was enough time to play all the games that were fun. Okay, there's a one. There's a two, but I have no idea. Nope. up here. Oh boy. Yeah, I didn't think that was going to make it in time. So what do we have down here? Oh, trinket coin. Rusted coin. Go up. It's another switch. Here's me a bit. Because it's going to be another battle room. Nope. Not another battle room. Just mean. Just weirdly mean. Alright. Go over here. I was interested in playing this game, given that unless there is one now, I don't think there's a wiki for it. Now, I, I haven't seen a whole lot of info for this game. Oh. Nope, can't go that direction yet. Rude. There we go. Alright, back the other direction. We haven't been down this this way yet. Kind of one of those like magic-y things. More over here. Well, that's my fault. Fish and sharks. 
interesting, but I can't do anything with it yet. This way. What do we have down here? Oh. Fish and sharks indeed. I think it wants me to go this direction, so I can't do anything with that even if I wanted to. Oh. It grayed out that, but we still have to kill the fish. I don't think I can do anything with it at the moment. Just go this way. Take that one out. Uh, um, I don't think I'm supposed to do that. Or maybe I am. I don't know. Whoops. This seems worrying. I don't know what I'm doing, and everything is worrying. I guess I should heal, get a bit more magic. Delete those guys. What else do we have? Oops. Oh, we're just back here. I'll just do this. Thread, ne thread the needle. Oh, that's not open yet. Anything else I'm missing? Nope. Yeah, we got that lower loop. Unless it's like a secret timed thing. Grab our money. Yeah, because we do have those doors. Up and down over here. Maybe it's something I can interact with. Well, I haven't been down yet. I'm just going to blow everything to kingdom come and then some. Alright. That's dead. Probably go back and find a save point at some point. Fortunately, can't do anything with that one at the moment. Or I think this one. I can't. Need directions. Are you lost? This is my home. I know where I'm going. Uh, I wouldn't mind a hit. Fuck. Actually, I don't know the layout of the lab either. But I know this corridor rather well. I was known for getting lost. They always sent interns to find me. That's kind of adorable. Okay. Got a bunch of these scuffed statues everywhere. Oh. Nope, that didn't work. If we're back in this area, we might as well go back to the way we've been. I, haven't, I have been down here, but I can keep going down. This lab is uh reasonably immense, actually. I'm kind of digging it. Oh, this seems like another one of those... Big uber, la uber locks. Help somebody. Huh. This lab should be deserted after I blew it up. Everyone should have evacuated. The sound was coming from over there. All this traveling around is very boring. So fighting robots and witches isn't entertaining enough for you? I mean, I just have to entertain myself by dropping you in spike pits. Don't oh, you dare. Okay, to be honest, I do that to myself enough times. Why is this spell so hard to use? There's some money. Oh, there's a person there. Oh, it's the deserter. She looks hurt. They weren't the gentlest bring me, bringing me in. Why are you here? After the explosion in the lab, I left the coalition. 
I thought no one would come looking. I guess I was wrong. I got caught and they were re and they they were rebuilding the lab. Guess the explosion didn't do the job. Sorry, Puck. I wanted to destroy the place that made you like this. Well, if they stopped rebuilding, your explosion destroyed some defenses, and I heard the guard saying the fake creature got in. Or a fake creature got in. They left me behind though. Can you let me out? I hear fake creatures like bargains. How about this? You let me out and I'll tell you a secret. Alright, how do we help you? The lab's in lockdown. Blowing up the power source will unlock my cell. Other locks will open up too. You can raid this place if you want. So it almost seems like I could have just restored Titania and gotten kind of a bad ending. My one hope is that as part of this, I do actually get to see all of the endings. It's always a bit of a shame when you can't. Yeah, I wasn't really expecting to find anything there. Uh, let's see. So this entire area is actually done for. Unless I'm mistaken. Could be. Sometimes am. Okay, so can't go down there. Oh, computers. They they have been documented to be skilled craftsmen. It isn't unheard of for some poor shoemaker leaving milk out and being blessed with brownies and pit uh pixies? Pixies. Helping him with his craft, creating the most elegant footwear. However, there are some crafts unknown to fake kind, such as the making of pastries. It is said that the court of the King of Avon awoke to a day of mayhem and confusion, as he found his entire pastry staff spirited away to the mischief by the mischievous Fay, never to be heard from again. Olav was a faithful husband. One day, he was riding his horse through the woods and saw Fay maidens dancing in a circle. Beckoning to him, one of them asked him to dance with her. Olav, being an upstanding husband, refused. Enraged, the Fay dancer shot Olav with an elven arrow. Though he made his way home, he dies in his beloved ar beloved's arms. Yeah, that is kind of a bit of a dick move. Okay. And there's our final lock. But... Have I done this one? Hey, 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 hey. What do you want? Found this cool sword at the dig site. On my way. Don't touch anything. I'm touching it. Oh, that's a gun. Let's see. Didn't you pass a PC because you couldn't grenade the enemy on it? Uh, maybe? Oh, boy. I guess that actually wasn't too bad. I just keep seeing these rude looking rooms. Er, what? Huh. That was shockingly easier than I thought it would be. That. None of these rooms look friendly. Aha, you can't catch me. I'm too fast. I think this is just back where I've come. Okay. Skip over a PC on the left side of the lab. It was above when you were walking and guarded by an enemy. Uh, If you can help me remember what quadrant that is at some point, that would be nice. Oh, that didn't work. Because, yeah, my problem is, I don't remember that, that moment. My brain's already elsewhere. It was in the lower loop on the bottom left. Okay. Yeah, what I'll probably do is just, um... Oh, that's... This is a scary room, for reasons. Oh. There 
There we go. I think that's all of the locks. Okay, so lower loop, they say. I guess here's the thing. I can just fly. Let's go looking. So lower loop, probably down one and over. What in in this room? I'd say that with relative certainty. Okay. Ain't in this room. Okay. And this is... Well, we can't get into this. This is the prison quarter. Flying wouldn't reset on a room-by-room -room basis. So it's got to be on that other lower loop. Oh, it's this one. Yeah, whatever. If I'd been kidnapped as a child, I doubt I would have recovered from the easy doldrums and sleepiness of life in Elf Flame. Adjusting back to human again was the hard part. Imagine being exhausted in bed, surrounded by plush pillows, warm covers, while a flurry of snow falls thickly outside. It's so early in the morning that the sun is just like a sliver of light on the horizon. There's a fire crackling heartily and a snoozing cat lies at your feet. Shaking off Elf Flame's influence is like getting up from that warm bed and having to do something like pay your taxes or shovel snow off the runway. Next time you tell me it's easy, try getting up from that warm, comfortable bed. I don't understand why anyone would want to wake up from when they could just sleep the day away. Why would someone want to get up from that bed? Uh... Alright. Thanks for the reminder. I wonder who was writing that then. Okay. So I think... I think we're done with this. Time to go down. Accessibility of flying off. Okay. So we have this. Where's the other down? Or is it... Is this both down? It is both down. Okay. Nope, that ain't gonna work. I don't think I'm supposed to be here, but whatever. What's the worst that could happen? Oh, this is gonna suck. Huh. I was funky. I was hoping I could grab it. There it is. Here's the question number one. Let's try the shotgun. Got it. All right, some more face over. How much face over do I have? Two, and I need seven. Ouch. <laughs> this room is hard. Or not, Rip. I never doubt my ability to break a game in my favor. <laughs> Even without accessibility cheese or anything like that. Doesn't always work, but boy, when it works, it works. Hello. I was convinced Alder Magic was the key to winning this war. I always wanted to find one and study it. To be able to actually fight an Alder when I was armed with the power of another, I was thrilled. I didn't quite turn out the way I wanted to, though. Wanted it to, though. 
Does she have anything else to say? Never much liked spiders. Uh oh. Wow, what is that? I'd rather not think about it. I didn't spend a lot of time in these areas. But you never forget that noise. Uh. Blessings upon thee, child. The time of Fay hath come, and bounty for us all. It's a bit early to be celebrating, Spirella. The humans still marshal their witches. Fern, child, thou hast always been dour-faced. Pray forgive myself for casting such musings aside. This world is full of delights, and mine, mine, mine. It was you, wasn't it? The Unseelie Court has never been happy with Titania's rule. You wanted the old ways back. Thou speakest in riddles, prithee. Speak, speak plainly to me in my dotage. You broke Titania, hoping to rule. Is that plain enough for you? You even have a piece of her on you right now. Hark, the youth leap so nimbly to, thy, to their judgment. How a mere changeling berates her alder. Thou wilt suffer for thine disrespect. Okay, so I can't destroy her. It's the drones. This is probably going to take a attempt or two. Let's try that again. Do I? Yeah, I want to keep the rocket launcher for this one. Alright, stay right where we're safe. Okay, there's more robots. Yeah, it seems like... Staying just reasonably far away from her seems to be the best strategy. get hit from that or hit by that I have no idea Ow. how many Okay. She's got some phases. Ow. Ow. Balls. Trick. Got her. Well fought, thou makest a worthy fairy, but that'll give you the rarest of fey gifts. The truth, uh, the truth plainly spoken. It was not my doing, nor the Unseelie Court, that Titania was torn asunder. 
the piece I wield I took from the witch that presided over this cursed domain. But I know it was fairies who betrayed her. Who else would do that but the Elflame's former rulers? A pretty riddle, is it not? Sisters can do the most unspeakable things. Sounds like it was maybe the seer. Or Buck. That was nail biting. It was hard. Yeah, the problem is I'm very reliant on these rocket jumps, and sometimes they don't work out very well for me. Sometimes they work out great. The cage is completely destroyed. That isn't good. We don't have to go back to the lab. The Iker refinery is right below us. We can escape there. I don't want to face whatever that cage was holding. Other parts of the lab should be open now. This is our chance to check it out. Who cares? What about our mission? We should just leave. Yep. Oh. 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 Yeah, I think shotgun will help. Okay. Huh. That's different. Kill me. I wish to... Yeah, two hits per kill. So healing once, interestingly enough. going no <sighs> yeah infinite MP might not be unreasonable it's true Yeah, let's uh let's throw an infinite MP for this one. This seems like it's going to suck. Can you ferry ferry jump off of the mossy platforms? No, you cannot.
Okay. Well, at least we got a save point. So, we are going to the left. There's nothing above, so it's just everything over here. And welcome to hell, suckers. At least that one didn't notice me. Okay. They're not chatting anymore. That's open. So it looks like these non-danger rooms are safe. Question. Oh. Prison's this direction. Yeah, this doesn't feel unjustified to me. Ow. That's entirely my fault, though. Uh... Safe room. Hell yeah. Oh, we still haven't taken out the power. We got this, though. By the time you see this, I'll be gone. I'm sorry I can't be here anymore. But even you can't be blind to what the Coalition is. Horrifying and revolting actions done in the name of preserving mankind. I used to feel it was either the Coalition or the Fae. But there are other survivors out here. People who are still living in a community built upon kindness, not clinging onto a way of life that is now incompatible with how I want to live. I think I'm going to grow some tomatoes. I know you'll hate me and probably de delete this message, but if you change your mind, I know you can always find me. E. I forget, who is E? Oh, and they are free. Hey, thanks, I'm free. About that secret? Huh, your little shadow ball there. Huh? The scientists at the lab didn't make him like that. When I was still working with the Coalition, oh, Eli, of course. They brought him in one day. He already looked like that. So maybe you shouldn't hate us so much. It isn't the humans that I hate. Anyway, thanks for the help. See you around, maybe. Got Fay of Love. Sweets. Okay, where am I going? I'm going this direction. Unfortunately, the unstoppable goop will continue to chase me, probably forever. I really, really wish it paused while I was on the map screen. Oh, I could have actually just boost jumped. Boost, boosted up that entire thing. Oh well, actually, let's go back this other direction, briefly. I just want to save. Because now that we've cleared out that lower section, so now all we have to do is figure out the shark. Ah. Uh... Which direction am I going? Yeah, the problem is I can't check the map, so I don't quite know where progress is. That hurts. Okay, stay away from the... Amorphous goops. I feel like I'm going in circles. I did go in circles. Oh, no. This ain't that shark door. Combat room. Really? Okay. So far, so good. 
Fish door. So we we are making progress here. Might not feel like it. Nope. You know what I feel like? What was that game? Phantom Abyss. It feels like I'm playing Phantom Abyss here. Okay, fish. 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 Oh, fish. And we're safe. There has to be more human settlements besides the Coalition. The Coalition claimed that they were our only chance of surviving this world. But their strict rules and regulations seem needlessly cruel. They made a system where it's impossible to leave, but they also take care of you as long as you do what they say. But I can't do that anymore. How can they say that say what they're doing is just the natural way of things? They spend so much time enforcing it. Other human settlements, I wonder what they're like. I have no idea. The Coalition is all I know about. Uh, no, all I know about the humans from this time. Are you curious if all humans are alike? Uh, not really, but maybe Maya would, would have been happier if she wasn't raised by the Coalition. Wow, she's a really bad artist, whatever that thing on the wall is. I drew that. You just keep a photo of yourself on your desk? That's Maya's desk, not mine. She keeps a photo of you on her desk? In a room you guys share? Yeah, what's the big deal? It was a birthday present. You gave Maya a picture of you for her birthday present. I mean, she liked me. I don't see what, why that's an issue. This is our room. Is this why you didn't want to leave? I can't believe it, Fern. You're putting us in danger just to check out your fake sister's old room? It was my room, too. There were some good, there were some good memories. She was really unhappy when we moved to the lab and away from the forest. That was when she started getting good with guns. There wasn't much else to do. At least she got got to decorate her own room. Very cozy compared to the cell I was in. You know, or while I was, you know, being experimented on. Maya, I wish you understood. You can't actually be feeling bad for her. She isn't your real sister. I've seen what people do to their real sisters. Maya cared for me. I can't deny that. Even if she's doing the wrong thing. I'm tired. I need to rest. I'll keep watch. Thanks, Puck. How can you- how high can you go? What? Okay, good. I've got my correct weapon. Come on! Okay, it's down here. Let's just restart this one. I've noticed the... Rocket launcher sometimes just misses. For no good reason.
There we go. I was not expecting a challenge room here. Rude. Four seconds. Final height, seven meters. Don't leave me here. Bad dream. Let's get out of here. All right. That was, uh, doable. I think I'm just going to turn on invincibility for that one, just because the damage wasn't too bad. I was so close, too. Less time I spend engaging with each of these. There we go, the better. Because, yeah, if I don't get stuck. I don't think being invulnerable really changed that one. Hey, wake up! Oh, I think I was having a really nice dream. A wall over there collapsed. Seems there's a passage through it. It was just a matter of knowing where the targets were and how to get to them. Hey, another trinket. Maya's trinket. I remember this. Can't believe she kept it. Is that macaroni art? Is that all? Yeah, it looks like we're actually done with the entire lab. Nice. We might actually finish this today. Let me double check. We're missing 13 lore and 20-something upgrades. Ooh, those 20 upgrades are a little concerning. And I'm still missing one item in this entire zone. Oh, but it could be in that Iker dump zone. Well, all things considered, let's turn on invincibility and flying. Oh, I still had infinite MP. Oh, wait. So I, I actually just didn't take a hit on that one. I guess I might as well leave infinite MP on for the time being. So where are we going? Aha! You can't scare me, weird blob thing. Yeah, I wonder if Maya's trinket actually changes any of our interactions with her. Could we have actually had a different... um? A different outcome for that one fight. Where is the trinket? Sentimental about the past. Sure, I'm just gonna leave that on. Oh, bullet blocking fairy orbits you. I'm gonna turn off Thorny Rose. And the damage over time. Nice as that would be. What else do we have? Contact damage while moving fast. Grenade power, everything. Extra damage and range at full health? No, that's not that helpful. Ah, more money drops. I don't know, I guess let's go for the corrosive bullets and the rusted coin. And I'll just leave the macaroni on. Yeah, don't forget the lore. Yeah, I'd like to get all of it before we're done. 
So I think we're just going straight down. You know, I was ex I was expecting some kind of Oh, that's that's a big bullet blocking fairy. I was expecting it to be uh like smaller and orbiting around me very directly. And not giant hunker to block all bullets occasionally. Everything kills you in one hit. Hey, some people like that kind of challenge. I don't. Oh. Now that we're here, uh, you know what? That fairy is just going to be permanently distracting. I'm going to turn it off. Let's go for the Lucky Clover instead. Turn those on, and we're good. Did you hear that? It sounded like something scuttling in the pipes. I don't like this. Rude. I see. Ow. But I've been here. What am I doing? Ah. Uh... So is there anything else? What is the one item that I'm missing? Unless it's a secret or a lore item. Uh, that sucks. And it's probably something like a somewhat hidden treasure chest. I'm going to hope it's not important. Because I'm not seeing any exits, and this game doesn't do breakable walls, at least to my knowledge. So are we done with this? I guess so. Oh, I think there was a face silver right before Maya's room. Oh no. I mean, it's fine. This is why ac accessibility sit settings are so nice. Yeah, the problem is that's so far away. Let's see, missing a bit in the white. White? Oh, you mean over in the gray? Yeah, I'm not interested in that at the moment. I... I know what I'm missing over there. I think I could do it now, if I wanted to. That's just a matter of getting to any of this stuff. Am I going the right direction? Yeah, I have no choice. Yeah, the true Metroidvania experience. Honestly, I feel like every Metroidvania, once you have, like, one or two items left that are missing, uh, in every zone, it should actually just highlight them. Or, like, you know, just have the room subtly flash, or maybe the sector of rooms, if they want to make it slightly vague. And, like, it could even be a lore entry that I've missed from, you know, dying and resetting. Uh, maybe talking to the picture frame. Who knows? I don't. Not ain't here. And the problem is, the only way I'm gonna find out is if I go over everything with what feels like a fine tooth comb. Likely.
Oh, there it is. It was the face over in that room. Yeah, so you you were completely correct. There was that one face over I'd missed. I I remember seeing it. I just forgotten that it was there with all of the other things going on. Aha! Silly jellyfishes. Let's see. I'm going the right. Yeah, I'm going the right way. They give you a trinket that makes you glow if there's a secret in the room you're in. I mean, that's nice at least. Am I going the right direction? Yeah, I am. Huh. Oh, that's interesting. The background was shifting like there was a panel opening, and I'm like, did I find something? The answer is no. Okay, so we're done with this area. So I, I guess let's just keep going back. The problem is there's only one zone left, so we might almost want to... I guess there's a little bit of the ochre zone left, but then otherwise, from what I know of the map, the last thing for me to do is to actually head down into the final zone of the game and potentially beat it. Okay, so the Iker refinery is completely done. Oh, I could have just warped out of that gate, couldn't I? I don't know why I kept thinking I was trapped in there. Okay, so I guess let's... Here's what we're going to do. We're just going to warp to each region. And see what we're missing. Factory roof. Oh, the problem is, it's like 12 out of 13 items and I have no idea where any of them are. Wait, hold up. Is this... There's a map that somebody made. Whoa. Uh, let's see. Hey, chat. I'm gonna give you guys a really ugly URL. However, that apparently has everything in it. You can see the whole dang map. So what am I missing? Probably a backpack or something. But yeah, there, there is a completed map at the very least. So that should make this a lot easier on me. I think I know where this one might be. Yeah, so I'm probably missing a piece of face silver or a backpack are my bets. I might as well farm a couple of enemies as we go by. It's kind of cheesy to get the money off of it, but whatever. Yeah, this is going to make finding the last couple of secrets way easier. Okay, so I think we want to go up, but not up here. Because I cannot. Oh. Was that it? No, that was not it. So mystery money treasure chest was... Not what I was looking for. made it really oh there it is I'd seen it before oh yeah whatever I'm just gonna fly for this one I know how to do that okay so now that we've done that guess I've got to go over here fortunately these some of these rooms are not quite as free form as I'd like them to be Up we go. Okay, so we're done with this area. 
Go to Chimney Root. So I'm missing an item here. My assumption is I know where it is. My assumption is it's up in the tea party zone and I might actually be able to do that now. I think it was right over here. I love tea parties, but latecomers are so inconsiderate. Step off, you're not invited. What? We don't start the party soon, okay. I'm going to turn off flying because... Got it. Thorny wings. Is he not twitching today? Unless I unfollowed somehow. So I... I uh, I'm on a bit of a sabbatical from Twitch. Uh, well, I'm trying to figure out what to do with myself. My big problem is almost everything that I used to stream, I'm getting like days and weeks ahead of time and it's all embargoed stuff. And that's making it a little harder for me to stream anything on Twitch because I no longer know what to stream. Because uh, I used to just stream new games as they came. And I guess I could still do that, but it would be inconvenient for me long term. Just gonna pop out my chat. This way I can look at the map and look at everything else. Um, but yeah, so I've just been kind of struggling a little bit to figure out how I want to handle a lot of things. I, I've been kind of in a semi-perpetual midlife crisis as a content creator for a while now. Oh, there we go. Uh, just because the... The landscape for streaming and YouTube and whatnot changes... has changed a lot over the last couple of years. Uh, it's probably not this. I think we already got that backpack. Uh, let's see. Yeah, we already got this one. So what do I, what do I be missing? Okay. Oh, uh, let's see. No. So we already have Sprite's breath. There might be some face silver that I'm missing. We already have the powdered nightshade. We already have short fuse. Oh, it might be at the bottom. You can run Twitch in the background on mobile. YouTube demands to be the only application. Yeah, I know that much. So the main problem is beyond just the embargoed thing. Uh, because of how YouTube has changed over the last couple of years, I'm in this kind of weird funk where... I used to be able to do Let's Plays, uh, but Let's Play content is pretty much dropped off on the platform. There are some channels that can still make it work. Oh, I'm not invin invincible. Eh, whatever. Okay, so we want to go down and then over, maybe? Uh, and so if I want to finish games like I used to, Streaming on YouTube works way better. What the hell? Okay, well, I found it. How? Yeah, but how do I use the wind? Yeah, I know there's I know there's a platform up there. Yeah. 
but I can't grapple onto it. Oh. That's, that's really cool. I think that's actually the first cross-room momentum puzzle I've seen in this game so far. Absolutely dastardly, though. Okay, do we have another thing? We might be missing the face over up top. Because we got the backpack. Unless I missed something with the one jumping puzzle. That would suck. Yeah, so it's either the MP at the far right, which it seems like the most reasonable option, or it's got to be somewhere else. But so, anyway, I'm trying to fly and I keep jumping into spikes. So... From my perspective, even though my viewership isn't uh, as good over here at the moment, I actually have, like, the ability to potentially finish a game on camera, which is something that I was not able to do prior. Oh, maybe I never did this? No. Maybe I just never got the MP here. Feels so nice to be out of the lab. We should have brought a picnic, uh, brought a picnic or something. Oh, sorry, I was too busy... Trying not to get killed by the lab sentry robots, captured by the scientist and caught up in the explosion. I forgot about your picnic. It's okay, I forgive you. What's more important is you learn from your mistakes. Uh, okay, this... I... Yeah, I've done this. Hmm. You did finish Wall World, so yeah. Yup. And so the, the thing I'm kind of struggling with on all of this is just... Oh, it's up here. Yeah, there's an M MP over here. That's what I was missing. Because uh, I've been able to finish Wall World, Dredge, uh, Terra Nil. And admittedly, I think there are... Oh, gosh. Okay, let's, uh, let's turn off flying. Don't tell me I needed that giant flyer. Nah. There we go. I knew it was going to be easy enough. Just had to f find it out. Okay, so if we go back, job's done. Accessibility turn flying back on. And continue on. So we're done with that area. There's nothing in the silver zone, so I don't need to worry about that. I guess let's go look at that really long, snaky gray zone. See if there's anything there. Um, But so, like, I don't know. As much as I'd like to do Twitch streams again consistently, I gotta figure out how to A, do it, and do it in such a way that it doesn't harm me. Uh, as it stands, I can only sit in a chair for so long. Uh, and, like, even right now, this one's getting kind of uncomfortable, but I'm going to stick it through since I'm almost done with this game. Um, I'm buying a new chair, so that'll help some to some degree, but even then, I'm kind of limited. Actually, you know what I should do? Because I should stand up. <clears throat> and you might also notice I'm starting to sound a little hoarser, too. That uh, as I get older, my cap capability of recording for long hours... Uh, like I used to, has kind of dipped off. And I'm not getting it back, and I might not. Ever. Which, like, is kind of sobering and kind of sad. Because I don't like being forced to change. But on the flip side, maybe sometimes change is kind of... Oh gosh, I've missed so much in this zone. There's five, I five items I haven't found. Are we able to collect the head now that we have all the other pieces? No, we're missing... we're missing one. I guess I'm just gonna fly around until we get what I'm looking for. Um... And so, like, to some degree, I don't know, I just have to kind of pick and choose what battles I can win versus not. Oh, there's an MP up there. 
Boy, I'd missed that. I think I think I know how to do that one. Yep. Nice and easy. Huh. That might be one. On that note, really like those accessibility options. The accessibility options are incredible. It's part of the reason why I wanted to finish this game. Is that, like, even if it gets to the point where I'm no longer capable of playing this comfortably... Um... Oh, right. We want to go, go to this. Have I been here? Yeah, I have. Huh. All right. Felt like I hadn't been there. Oh well. Still say they should be called cheats. Nah, eh. cheats accessibility options. See, for me, I feel like I guess the problem is calling them ste uh calling them cheats stigmatizes them a little bit for people that need them. And so part of the reason why I've been using them uh to this extent is to some degree. I want this kind of to be normalized as, like, a thing that developers uh, consider as far as, like, options in their games. Like I said, I am getting older, and nothing would make me sadder than to, you know, be, like, 50-60, something like that. Uh, not, not just be 50-60, but, like... Get to the point where there's all these cool games coming out when I'm, you know, in, what, 2040 or something like that? Uh, or 2050. And I'm just not able to play them because I've got shit hands. And, uh, the reflex tests are so high and all that, you know, all that jazz. It would suck. And so, like, hopefully it's not gonna be an issue. I don't know. Have you found my face yet and my name? Oh, so this is oh the bells. One four two three four one. That was it. But yeah, you're using it as a time saver and to maintain your san or maintain your sanity. Yup. Like there's there's a lot of reasons why I specifically love these accessibility options. Um, it is shaved off hours of this playtime. I am sure. And yeah, since I've already played through almost all of these and done all of these things too, uh, I'm kind of in this like really nice, con uh, or being able to fly through the levels is just, it's so, so convenient just in terms of saving me all of that grief and effort that I would have otherwise had to, uh, I'm not going to say struggle for. But... Uh, let's see, how would I put it? I don't like repetition past a certain point. It gets kind of exhausting. Uh, fighting the same boss 30 different times. Like, that's kind of fun, but after a certain point, you're just kind of sick of it. Uh, so I was kind of having that problem playing Fury when I was uh, when that game ca came out. I know I've brought that one up a couple of times over the course of this, but like I think Fury is an absolutely rad game that is intentionally left inaccessible to most players. Um... It did have an easier mode, and I I respect it for that, but I found the easier mode didn't really change much. It Honestly, it just made the game feel kind of worse. Alt-tab? Shouldn't. No. Yeah, it ain't showing anything. And so, like, I don't know. I want more games to be accessible to more people. Not less. And I know that kind of cuts down on the prestige of a lot of them, but from my perspective, the prestige of playing games should be the enjoyment you had and the stories you can tell from it, not the, I beat, you know, uh, Elden Ring butt, buck naked and barehanded. Well, actually, no, that's it. That is where the achievements should come from, not 
I beat Elden Ring. Can you beat Elden Ring? And it's like, no, actually, I, I mean, I could, and I probably would like to sometime this year. But like, as it stands right now, Elden Ring is just a little too in inaccessible for me uh, between time and some other issues. There might actually be a trinket I'm missing. Oh yeah, there is. Weird. I must have seen it and just left. Uh, let's see. Shall we go get that girl's face first, though? Before I forget. Yeah, let's do it. But yeah, from my perspective, uh, like, I grew up with Tony Hawk Pro Skater, which I really, I really like. The original one. I'm dog shit at it. Because I never learned how to play, because I just played with Moon Gravity on. Oh, I could have actually swung underneath those that entire time. Um... But so, like, I played with Moon Gravity and Perfect Balance when I played uh, Tony Hawk's Pro Skater, and it was great. I had a blast. Never learned how to get, play the game properly, but I don't regret it. Okay, so it is one four two, three four one. One, four, two, three, four, one. Ah, uh, I could refine. Oh. Oh. Uh, hold up. I should not have any of these on. Okay, let's try that again. Uh... Where? Okay, we're going this direction. Guess I'm going to turn flying and infinite back MP back on for a hot second until we get back. I wish that one actually had a um, a save point at it, considering it seems pretty hard. Okay, let's turn these off. One, four. Two, three, four, one. All right, let's do this face horror. screwed. Wait, there was a save point by the bells? What? You mean I can literally get saved by the bells? Alright. Let's, uh... Ow. Pistol's godly for that fight. Yeah, I can imagine that. Wait, there's a dog? I saw a Shiba. Yeah, there's one here. How did I miss that? One. Four. Two, three, four, one. Okay, pistol. Oh, gosh, yeah, the pistol is godly. I didn't even realize we're almost done. Unless there's a second phase to this. I... 
Well, we got the face and many faces. Well, there's a lot of faces here. There's no way we can carry all of these. Just grab one. Let's go. It's not like she'll be able to tell the difference anyway. Okay, I got one. Let's go. Face off. That's horrifying. Hey, thank you thus for the... What is THB? What currency is that? Thank you for the thub. Uh, for the hundred thub. I have no I, I truly have no idea. T, what countries? Oh, God, geography is like my, the one thing I'm beyond Garbo at. All right, we should probably go get the, uh, secret open. For the door here? Cool. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. yeah, where do we go? Oh, you know what? I just realized I'm missing another section in the green. And we're missing one item, but there's actually a uh, door to the left. Well, dude, can you look up what THP is as a currency? <laughs> Thailand. Got it. And thank you for the or original or the additional uh, 40 Thai bath. Bath? I have no idea how it's... Bath? Bint? Bot. I have no idea how to pronounce that, unfortunately. Gosh. Oh. Okay, this is one of those rooms. Wow, that was actually shockingly easy. There's no... There's but one rule of succession in Fair Elflame. The throne is for all who... All of those who have the will and power to take it. Our fair queen Titania overthrew, overthrew the Unseelie court and banished them from our realm. Well, that should be the end of this. Okay, so this area is done. So now we're heading back to the purple. What is the fastest way to do that? Well, it's becoming a flying invincible MP hacker again. Yeah, I'll probably just stick to the pistol, maybe, for this. Ooh. That looks really cool. No, we should probably just go up from purple lands. There we go. There's one thing I've actually kind of enjoyed about streaming on YouTube is, uh, whatever super chats I get are not always in dollars, and so it's just like, I have never heard of that currency before. I would like to go to Thailand someday. I don't know when we're going to find the time for it. Because I'm probably going to do Iceland, Japan, and then Europe. Maybe not in that order before I try Thailand. Yeah, both Shell and I are huge suckers for Thai food. And... You know, honestly, I think the restaurants in the US are pretty good. But I'd still like to try, like, the real stuff. Here we go. Find your face. Have you found my face yet? And my name? Here you go. OMG, my face is back. Thank you so much. You're my heroes. I gotta repay you somehow. Oh, I know. Here I come. Uh. How'd you like my candy kiss special? You don't have a trinket for us or something? Of course she doesn't. She's a human. Oh, why did we decide to help a human again? Because I'm the best. Whatever. We didn't get get you a face for nothing. We're taking your shoes. That's fine. Ruby slippers. OMG, the way everything's like covered in moss now? So aesthetic. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Just yoinked her shoes. At least she doesn't mind. I like this game. I don't know. I, uh... There's something about Metroidvanias... Like, the ones that kind of go for the more, like, pseudo-bleak but heartwarming story are the ones that, like, really get to me. I had the same general feelings about Ghost Song last year. Okay, so her shoes... There they are. Run faster. Oh, yeah, that's pretty good. Let's get rid of the erosive bullets. It's time to go fast. Well, that's kind of nice. Okay, so we got the slippers. We are still missing three items in the area. How? Where? Unless they're in that hell ascent. Wait, what? 
Oh. That was just the alternate side of the speed run. I hope it I hope there are no items in there. Check the map. No, it's actually not even listed. Sweet. I guess you don't have to worry about that, at the very least. What other items am I missing? Because, like, it might look like there's a lot of level left, but there really is not. I guess I should get my bearings all the same. Yeah, nothing here. Because, yeah, there's nothing over here. We got this chest. Let's just keep going around. There's nothing to the right. Is there? Wait, I gotta double check. There might be a lore stone? Oh, it's below me. Go that direction. Did I miss the lore stone over here? Yep. Actually, did I? Obron they they call. Wait, Obron they call me, and sometimes Titania, High King and Queen of the Fairies, Queen Mab, the Mother of Dreams, one ruler of Hellflame. Nicknavin, the Elder One. No single name can hold my grandeur. All names I claim for my own. A glamour that outshines all other. Wow, Titania has a lot of names. One time I met her, she was going by King Oberon. The more powerful a fae is, the more names they tend to have. And the stronger the glamour. To appear however one wishes, who wouldn't want that power? Okay, I guess I hadn't gotten this one. Um... I guess, let's just try. See if I can figure it out. I mean, my assumption is probably shotgun. Rocket launcher? Yep. And then it would just warp us back. Okay, cool. At least I know how to get to that one. And... That counts as an item. Perfect. In Shakespeare's play, isn't Puck Obron and Titania's child? I don't think so. I think he's more of like their jester. Already got this one. Cause that was a that was a face silver. Oh right, they can't hurt me. I think. I'm just gonna leave invincibility on. I'm being lazy. Huh. Okay, energy refiner. Is that it? Yeah, it looks like that was it. So what does the energy f refiner do? That is... No, that's thorny wings. Extra damage while airborne for a while. MP by grappling enemies. Huh. Oh, well. Oh. I think I... I think I see where the last one could be. 
I almost kind of wish there was a hotkey for flying. There's a lore stone, like, way down at the bottom, over here. That I very well could have missed. Here we go. I bet I missed this one. A long time ago, a member of the Big Fae offended our fair queen Mab, mother of dreams, ruler of Hellflame. What offense was, none can remember. What the offense was, none can remember. Perhaps not even the queen herself. But from that day on, no Big Fae was allowed to wear a glamour with more than one eye. Okay, so that's it for this zone. Cool. And now, we just continue on into the gray zone. I always kind of like the end of a Metroidvania uh, completionism rush. Because it's not really a rush, but the, hey, now that I know I can for sure get everything, let's go back for all of it. It's satisfying. It's, it's the feeling I think I'm always looking for in, um, oh god, this area is so huge. It's the, it's the feeling I'm always looking for specifically in, um, open world games, but I never get. Because they're so big, it becomes kind of impractical for me to try and get any of them. Okay. Yeah, first trinkets in yellow. Yeah, I'm not looking for that at the moment. I'm going through each zone one by one. Uh, let's see. So are there any rooms I'm missing? There's the upper section, and that might be it. So in that case, we're missing two items. Well, hold up. How many items are in that top section? One. So there's something else. Probably a face silver or a lore stone somewhere in this zone. I guess let's just go looking. I forgot how, like, ephemeral the music in this area is. I like it. Let's just go over one more. I'm pretty sure I went up here. Or not? Uh. Might not have gotten to this one. Well, we just got it. Upon this corpse that was once a home, I hear the cry of kin alone. Wiggly toed, rubbery face, swimming in the human's waist. Will someone please not spare a thought for Abby the fairy in a tight spot? No, I think I had gotten that one. Yeah, I had. Which face over do I have for? Dang. Not nearly enough. So there might be another one over here? No. I've definitely gotten this one. Abigorath, the devourer, has shaken the foundations of our lab. Drownings have only increased. Roars in the night have driven most of us to madness. What else can we do but abandon this post? Yeah, we definitely got that one. I think we got whatever this was. Face silver, I'm sure. Okay, so now that we've done that... Or no, is that where we got the rocket launcher? I don't know, it doesn't... Doesn't strictly matter. Oh no, that, that was the face silver chamber. Epigoreth the Devourer is one heck of a name. If I had a dog, I would consider it. Like, I would totally name my dog some kind of weird, wild demon name. Just, just for the heck of it. Just because it feels like that's what you're supposed to do with dogs. Like, sure, you could call it, like, Poochums. But that's boring as heck. Give me a dog name that inspires terror. And then it's going to be, like, the floppiest golden retriever. Just not even a single threatening bone in its body. And 
and his name is like Mephistopheles. Cerberus? No, that's too generic. I would also consider calling my dog Emperor Palpatine. <laughs> Just because. The dog's not gonna understand and everybody else is gonna be like, why? And I'll be like, I don't know. Why not? It's a dog. What does the dog care if it's named after, uh, you know, the greatest Sith Lord that ever lived. Well, I'm not entirely sure if that's the case. I'd also consider, like, Darth Revan or something just for the, you know, nerd cred. But on the flip side, if I called it, like, Palpatine or something, I could then proceed to say, like, yes! Do it! Kill the Jedi, but at my dog. And then it would be confusing. Otherwise, I could call my dog Henchman. Or Henchman? Goon. Ooh, Goon. That'd be a good dog name. Minion? Eh. Maybe a couple years ago before Despicable Me came out. But now I think Minion would be a little bit, um... Tacky. Okay. Actually, this is, like, a lot easier to do. I guess I technically have flying still on. I should probably turn that off. Just had to get the angle correct. Ooh. Oh. Almost missed that one. That would have been unfortunate. am I supposed to get up that one? I'm not even sure. Yeah, shotgun time? I, I suppose. Problem is I keep getting stuck under that one. Oop. There we go, got it. Hey, are you okay? We should probably help her. Thanks for the helping hand. I have this trinket and I'll consider the debt repaid. I'm not foolish enough to make any bargains with Faye. So you don't care that I escaped? I already told Maya that you left. She didn't say anything, so I won't do anything. I thought she'd be angry. Who cares? Trinket found. Fate of hate. We. I do wish there was such a thing as bench warping in this. Oh, right. I guess let's just turn flight back on. 
It'd be nice to be able to just fall because faster, but on the flip side, there's spikes. And spikes are rude. Ooh, yeah, if you could, uh, Shell said, imagine if you could plant a fairy ring. And yeah, that's, that would be a joy. I would like that. Oh, if you don't know what a fairy ring is, it's just a circle of mushrooms that randomly forms. I don't actually remember why they form, but they've always been kind of, ooh, that thing's angry. But they've always been one of those, like, superstition-y, you know, the, those things that people, like, get kind of superstitious about, which makes sense. They're definitely a little bit more, like, fantastical than a lot of other... I don't want to say, like, natural phenomenon. Okay, where am I? Where am I going? What is my plan here? Yeah, I guess there's supposed to be portals into the Fey realm or some such business. Okay. I think, I think I've done this one. Because I definitely remember this. I think I had the rocket launcher by that point, so it was a little easier. Oh, I did not check. I didn't check for the potential mana up here. Because I think I went into this room. Oh, no, I definitely checked for this. Did I kill it? I did not. Give me old money. Huh. Call fairy rings witch rings where I'm from. People taught us that that's where witches would dance. Huh. Okay, so what am I missing? I guess there's maybe the lore stone at the end? Yeah, it's probably the lore stone at the very, very end. I'm kind of shocked that the uh, rocket launcher doesn't seem to have an AoE. Oops. Oh, did I go the wrong direction? I did. I did go the wrong direction. Because I gotta go over here and then down. Well, not over here. That's where a mini map would actually come in. Real handy. And mycelium patches with fungus popping up at the edges. Okay. I'm just surprised that they would be so organized as part of that. Were I a mush mushroom colony, I'd probably just want to fill in the whole dang circle. But then again, I am not a mushroom colony. Oh, it's this thing. If I'd been kidnapped as a child, I doubt I would have recovered from the easy doldrums and sleepiness of life in the elf land. Adjusting back to being human again was the hard part. Imagine being exhausted. Wait, we've already read that. What? What? That is literally the same lore. Yeah, we already had that one, but that was... That was it. Like, that... That lore entry was actually a duplicate. Oddly enough. Did we die? Uh... No. No, because I I'd read that same lore entry in the um in the lab, I believe. So I, I think at this point we're good into the ochre area. Cause I th I think we've gotten everything else. Oh, there's there's a little bit left. Oh, it's not it's you. Oh, I forgot how much I did not like this zone. I mean, I'll be fine. 
but... Well, I haven't been down yet, so let's turn off all of our accessibility options and let's... Let's start exploring. Uh, never mind. Can't do that one. Let's turn all of our accessibility options back on. I'll just do two of them. I don't need MP. I mean, luckily we should be done with almost every platform... Uh, platforming challenge in the game. Okay, teleporter's here. I'm gonna go back to the smith. Okay, we want to go to back to the pipe. Because I believe... I've missed something here. Oh, unless of course the final item... is this. I bet that's it. Because we got the... I believe we got all the lore stones. And that would make sense. There's one more damage upgrade. Did I get anything else? Any other trinkets? Oh, right. The Fate of Hate. Oh, Fae of Hate. Damage dealing fairy orbits you. Okay. Was well, there anything else for me to do here? Not really, no. Yeah, Fae of Hate does a, a fair bit of damage. Yeah, I kind of figured it would. All right. Yeah, I guess to the quarry. Because big question before we go anywhere. Did I do this? Yes. I went through that heck. Did I do this? I most assuredly did. Okay. Anything else? I don't think so. Can I go over here? Yes. Battle room. Oh boy. Well, that hurt. And it is genuinely a bad sign for my chances in this region. I now have no HP. Uh. Ah. That sucks. Let's do that again. Uh, let's see. Honestly, maybe pistol. There we go. I gotta get better at timing those wheels. Well, that makes a difference. Oh, I made it. Oh, that didn't work. Feels like everything does more damage here. Which I'm a little worried about. Oh, good. To think I'd come... I'd have... Uh, to think I'd have come this far. Barrow's ceiling. The roof of the bottom of the world where Elflame lies in wait. If I make it to Elflame, I wonder if I'll be safe there. Do tomatoes grow in Elflame?
Yeah, see. This is why I like the rocket launcher. Reed's challenging climb ahead. When I'm not mountain climbing, I've been making these signposts. It's super exciting to discover fun new trails, and putting signs up helps people find them too. Oh no. You found my flags. I put them all at the end of the trails to find other mountain climbing enthusiasts. No, not another. We found the flag door. Start that one over. Uh, I don't have flying on, right? I do not. Launcher is still going to be my better friend on this one. Eh. This might be a shotgun, though. That sucks. Combination of all the flight challenges in two minutes. Probably the hardest platforming challenge in the game. I hate to say this, but I don't think I can do it. <laughs> I just want to look at this. Like, what am I up against here? Because I can't even get over that. You can do it. Dude, my problem is, I don't wanna. I really don't wanna. I'm sorry, I'm, I'm out, I'm tapping. I'll leave this for the real, real pros. Uh, gosh, I've already burnt a quarter of my time and I'm just flying. Wow, you have a great technique. I was taking notes the whole time. Take this trinket I found on a climb. I'm sorry. I just I can't. I can't do it. I want to I want to finish this game. Grapple destroys basic bullets. Ooh. Cost 10 though. But yeah, I I'm hitting my limit on like skill and some other things and like maybe I could do it, but cripes. Okay, oops. Let's do it. Tell me. Oops. Uh, let's see, so what else do we have around here? Go for the rocket launcher. Yeah, I, I sincerely respect anybody who can pull that off. And, like, I think I, wi I wish I could, 
but it's one of those where my voice is starting to get tired and I kind of want to beat this game today. Because if I can, if I can have it done. That'll make my life much easier. This is another one of those. Yeah, it is. And there's lore stone at the top. How? Oh. That was a lot easier than I thought it would be. Oh. Oh. Okay, good. I'm just gonna turn on invincibility. Okay, good. Oh, hold up. making that so hard. One of the new children brought in just won't stop crying. Spun candy from a long destroyed civilization, golden tears from a celestial unicorn, and even mulled wine grown from the grapes of the Garden of Eden would not stop her tears. But our dear wise queen lifted the child up though the child's face was unattractive and blotchy and whispered to her a few words and the laughter of children echoed in our halls again. Wait, she gave, gave a kid alcohol. Don't worry, it was really good wine. Maybe the kid just stopped crying because the buzz kicked in. It does strike me that the Fey are absolutely terrible custodians, but I think that's kind of supposed to be the point here. Oh, almost had it. Oop. Oh, I guess we're just supposed to go this direction. Screw you, bird. Battle room. Oh no, not you. Actually, this is weirdly effective. Or I'm still invulnerable, aren't I? Aha, I was wondering why he couldn't hit me. Don't worry about it. I hate his guts. Pfft. When I first encountered a fae, I felt pathetic. They were so much more beautiful than I. So much more elegant. I deserved to fall down at their feet and serve them with all my heart. That is the real danger of fake glamour. It makes you feel worthless. That's the power of glamour. It changes the way the world sees you. I feel I'd use it, use it so the world sees me as I see myself. A nice girl? Oh, I don't think I'm very nice. We... I guess I might as well just save here. That was kind of a dodgy connection point. I don't think I see anything else. Okay, here we go. Ow. Come on. There we go. Nope, that didn't work. Eh. Dang. I skip out on the hard platforming challenge, and we still got hard platforming challenges. I think this is all just for a shortcut back into the red. That I already opened at some point. What? Oh, yeah. Huh, fancy that. Uh, I guess let's just go to the right. <laughs> Rude. I just want to get by. I don't want to be messing around with Iker junk. Fine. Okay, so we just go down back into the pipe.
I still need three pieces of face silver. Unless there's some whole region that I've missed. I don't think so. All right. Three, one, four. Three, one, four, two, four. Hey, I remembered it. Oh. I think we found the lore room. There once was a lonely village surrounded by wilderness that the world ignored for a very long time. But as mankind grew, they built great iron tracks that connected people together. Railroads, a new invention that, to unite the world. Each morning, the villagers could see the steam approaching in the distance as the tracks crept closer to their home. But humanity's industry was opposed by the iron-hating fey who lived under the land, and it seemed the age of men was ending as fey began to emerge from the barrows. The village soon suffered from sickening cows, kidnapped children, and more mischief than ever before. None of the villagers' gifts were enough to appease the fey. In the lonely village, there lived a child like no other. This child had a pure heart and was kind even to the most undeserving. The fey were drawn in by their charm and swore not to harm them, for this human was their beloved child. One day the, hum the child wandered into the woods where it is said that, uh, said that the door to Elflame lay. Days passed and the villagers grew worried. When the child finally reappeared, they were healthy and unharmed, but their charming smile had turned sad. The child never spoke of what happened in the woods. After the child's mysterious adventure, no fairy was ever seen in the world again. Even as humanity rejoiced, the villagers noticed that the child had changed. Their personality had turned melancholic, and their child often looked towards the forest. One day, the child wandered back into the woods and was never seen again. It is said that as long as the iron of mankind remains strong and humanity continues to flourish, the Fae would be unable to return, repelled by the metal they so hate. Well, that's a bunch of lore. So yeah, we actually only have two lore left. Uh, 10 upgrades. Alright. There's a little bit left that I'm missing, but not much. Oh, this is gonna be weird. I will... Okay. What's gravity? What's gravity, precious? Er, ow? Rude. Wait. Oh, there's just no gravity here, period. Uh, I think I'm gonna just give myself infinite MP here. This just seems like an inconvenience otherwise. Nope. Especially considering how much damage that does. Oh. Lee smokes. Oh, are we just going to be shotgun flying here? I've definitely done this in a game. And I want to say it was Prey, but it was probably something else. It's hard to move around here. Huh. Using guns with high recoil would give you a boost. Oh, it's because I had a little bit of iframes left over. That's funny. I was probably supposed to use the rocket launcher or the, um... I was supposed to use the rocket launcher or something else to 
get access to that, but whatever. It's fine, use the boost to get through. Uh. Boy, my healing is trash. I would have really expect. Uh. I would have. Uh. Any others? No. This room is a unique form of heck. Oop. Fine, I will heal. Yeah, the Iker charm probably would have helped. Okay, not too much momentum. Okay, so that's gonna push me upwards. Hacking turrets. Who? What was? The oh, oh! There's one of those there. Yep. Ow, rude. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna be leaving infinite mana on here. Trying to not have it for this just sounds like an exercise in frustration. I can save. Okay. Uh, yeah, let's go up. Uh. And here we enter our punished Wanderbot arc. Uh. Oh, no, 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 no. Yes, yes, lore. Ardina Silverweaver was a fae who produced the most exquisite of garments. She had a human lover named Olaf. Though he, she gifted him with many treasures, he eventually returned to his village to marry his betrothed. One day he returned to our borough. Ardina implored him to stay, but he refused, and he only returned to beg for more gifts. Ardina bade him to wait, as she returned with an enchanted sword, one of our finest treasures. She asked him to give her one last kiss. When he bent to kiss her, she stabbed him. Huh. More stories should end in a good stabbing. That's interesting. Different from the other Olav story. Lore room? Seems like a fight room. I don't know what's going on in this one. The gravity was normal, too. Uh, I don't know about that one. Wait, that's a gate? What are you? Oh, cool, I can buy things from it. Green particles when there's a secret room. Yes. Powdered face silver. Much longer bullet range. Yes. And heavy ammo. Shooting pushes you back a little. Yes. Alright, cool. So here's the thing. Uh, let's see, what do we want to get rid of? Well, I don't think I need more money drops. I don't think I need to run faster. Heck, I'm not even sure if I'm going to need the magnet anymore. We're literally missing just two trinkets at this point. We are almost done. Uh... Now I just have to find much longer bullet range. Yeah, let's snag that one. I'm almost wondering if I pack both of those on. 
I bet that would be really good. I could go for the extra knockback, but I want to see. Sniper shotgun? Oh, sniper shotgun. And yeah, I could have gotten the thing that gave me more kickback, but that sounds scary. Okay, and yeah, this one's locked off until I do some more. Welcome back, Fern. Long time no see, huh? Uh, hi. You know this fairy? Maybe, I don't remember. I'm really bad at faces, and this one doesn't even have a face. Why does the Iker kind of look like eyes in there? Okay, so that's pushing down. that happen? Oh. oh, we're safe. Ah! Ah! <laughs> okay, so we got that open. This is chaotic. But kind of neat. Nope. Oh. Oh, I see. I guess I'm just gonna heal here. Oh. We have friend. Hold up. Yeah, the rocket launcher does not have the same kickback that I'm looking for necessarily, but boy, does it absolutely shred enemies with shields. Nope. There's a path there, but I can't take it. Whoa, you have some serious power on you. Guess you really succeeded, huh? You're gonna bring back our lady? Long live the queen. Ugh. Unfortunately, Fern's starting to look kind of worrying. Hmm. Yeah, I'm, I'm suspicious of Puck, but the odd thing is, like, he's acting more like Fern's morality than I would have expected. Expected. Puck is usually the person who leads you astray. Oh. Oh, it's just Faye Silver at the end. Cool. Uh... Oh boy. I guess actually this is really easy. All I have to do is just go backwards. Is Fern getting progressively redder? It might be the, uh, the like, visuals for this environment. But it does definitely feel like she's been turning uh, kind of ghoulish looking, yeah. Nope, that didn't work. Uh, 
Okay. She's launching herself up, and that's the last thing I want her to do. Badly, but it did not. It's the bunginess. Just absolutely wrecks me. It's fine. Okay. It's uh terrifying. Oh, I see. Not that open. There's a safe statue right here. Yes. What? Let's go over. Going down. Nope. There we go. Going down seems scary. All right, next. Ow. There we go. Anybody else? Nope, looks like we're good. I think I'm just gonna keep infinite mana on, but heal very sparingly. The game seems to give me infinite mana pads anyway. Fairly often. Oh, it's you. That creature. I remember him. He was invulnerable earlier. Whoa. Why is the gravity around here all wonky? When Queen Titania was shattered, the witches used her magic and put a barrier between Elflame and the human world. Fairies in the human world couldn't go back to Elflame, and fairies in the Elflame couldn't get out. But you've been taking down the witches, haven't you? The barrier is weakened. That only surrounds the main court further in. Once we restore the queen, she'll take the barrier down completely. The court of Elflame. Looks beautiful even from a distance. Why am I just really fast? Oh, gravity's normal here. Okay, we've got a fast travel location. It's Titania's eye. I think we have enough pieces now. Guess we should bring it back to the Seer. No, we can't trust her. Nell said that one of the Fae broke Titania into pieces. We should give this to someone in Titania's court, not the Seer. 
So sorry to hear that, Changeling, but I'll be taking that. I can't move. It was so satisfying breaking my sister into pieces, but the humans just had to scatter them across the lands, didn't they? Well, now that pieces are all here, I can get rid of Titania for good and absorb her power for my own. I knew you were the... I knew you were a traitor. Traitor? Not likely. You said it yourself. I was never part of my sister's court. How could I be? It would... It would exceed humiliation to have lost the throne to Titania and bow and scrape to her every day after. No, I carved my own path, and as people like us often do. Don't worry, Fer Fern. The Fey will still have their age. It's just that I will finally be the one leading them. Not that you'll ha you'll live to see it. No, you promised you wouldn't hurt her. There are consequences for breaking our bargain. No Fey is capable of breaking any bargain. I didn't promise that I wouldn't harm her. Only that I would grant your wish when I'm done. After all this time, you haven't learned to be careful what you wish for. Fuck, you knew this whole time? Why would you do this? Ugh. Come on, Fern. I think I can break you out of her stunning spell. Struggle all you want, little ones. I will just strike you both down. Oh, piss. Okay. All right, let's try that again. With my gun. And my trinkets. Cause yeah, let's get rid of the spice gunpowder in favor of the Fey of Hate. Now are we done? Is this the last boss? The can't be, right? Cause we've got a whole area left to go. Um. That is, that's the final boss. Okay, that's the final boss. So in that case, go down? I guess I'm going to have to go here. Yeah, we're still missing one piece of face silver. I, I know where it is, too. We just have to go get to it. Okay. Yeah, same dialogue. Okay. Do we want to just hop down? Interesting. Yeah, we still haven't seen anything else about the beloved child. So I need to get around here. There's also something left in the ochre zone. Actually, I should go the other other way around. Because, yeah, I, I was assuming whatever that um, thing that I was missing, the ochre zone. Here, I'm just going to turn on invincibility for this. And I'm going to try flying. Oh, good. Oh, look at that. Oh, sweet Bessie. That makes this whole zone way less garbage. Ow. Because, yeah, we hadn't gone this direction. I'm... I'm just gonna... I'm getting really hungry. So I think I'm probably just going to speed run past everything else unless it seems really interesting to explore it. Uh, let's see. Did we... We got the face Silver there. There's one more over to the side. Nope, that's a death zone. I do wonder if we're meant to be the child. I was under the impression that it was, like, a sibling or something. Like, I know Fern got betrayed. Oh. Uh, you know what? A bit of a head start. Nope, that didn't work. Oh, that ain't gonna work. Oh, boy. 
This one's a ruder. Ruder zone than I thought it would be. Okay, so we pretty much want to head for the this side. After that one section. Uh. <gasps> oh, come on. The problem is I can't make myself invulnerable here, otherwise the Iker doesn't do anything. Okay. Yeah, I can speed down the left side for most of it, it's just getting there. Okay, there we go. Got it. Make sure we don't blow past anything. There's the last piece of fee silver. Derp. Okay, so I think that's it for this area with the exception of whatever's at the... Well, whatever's in the final boss chamber. Guess I should probably go save. Oh, wrong direction. I appreciate that it gives me the boost out of there. Okay. Right, let's turn flying back on. Because we still wanted to find... We still want to find whatever is on the other side of this ochre door. All the way over here. Oh, I guess there was a southern path. Because, yeah, it's here. And then... Wait, what? Oh, there's another, there's a couple of doors that I've maybe missed. Yeah, there's a warp zone in the left of the ochre. Yeah, I'd missed that. And it, remind me when we come back through, there's something above the shop. We had somehow missed that. Okay, so we want to go over and then up. And this is open. Yeah, so I hadn't fallen down this. Pfft. 
It's a big boost pad. All right, so here's the rest of the ochre zone. Uh, let's go to the right first. Dude. Okay, there's probably more to that. Oops. Oh, right, I have flying on. I probably shouldn't here. I think I'm just going to turn on invincibility, though. <laughs> I missed. Eh. Really obnoxious. Come on. It's like I'm right next to it and it just doesn't it doesn't wanna. It just, like, goes straight through for whatever reason. Like, it's right there. I don't... I don't understand why I can't hook it. Unless... Literally, I'm too close. I don't want to just fly though. Like I I'm doing that as kind of a last resort. Okay, here we go. I'm doing that as a last resort largely for the sections that like I know I cannot do. Right, I'm still invincible. Uh, having a slightly difficult time immediately carrying. I probably should. All right, let's uh. Go back up here. Holy smokes. This whole ochre zone, man. I can't get my grappling hook back. I'm actually entirely unsure how you're supposed to do this one. Unless you're literally supposed to land on the magic pixel. Oh.
I have to do... Nope. Okay, rocket jump. Okay, that's scuffed. Aside from Titania, there's an only one other that can call himself king, for he is the monarch of the sort, and one our fair ruler loves dearly. He wears a coat of dead leaves and wanders along lonely roads, filling them with music from his magic flute. We speak of him only in whispers, the rather strange changeling king, keeper of Elflame's many children. Oh, Elfame? Oh, oops. I've never met him. What is he like? Uh, he's very nice, and his favorite animal is the rat. Oh, the Pied Piper. Okay. 99 people watching and only 83 likes. Something seems fishy here. I've noticed my streams can be a uh, little low-key. Especially if I'm not streaming, like, the big, high, uh, most popular games. Oh. Okay, nothing there. So we have to go around, down and around. Oh boy. This is heck. Please be done. Oh, I'm tired. Okay. Yeah, unfortunately, this is one of those where it's like, if I wasn't stream, uh, if I wasn't trying to stream this. This wouldn't be super bad for me. Um, oh, piss. Okay, we've been here. I don't think there's anything here. I'm gonna switch back to this, make sure there's nothing else I missed. Okay, back down we go. Pistol. I guess we didn't, we didn't lose too much. That's a pretty good view to like ratio. It's true, it's very low numbers compared to where I'd like to be and compared to where some of my streams were. Uh, like Dredge, for example, seven, eight hundred people. It was very confusing. I'm not entirely sure how and why. Like I realize it being the like biggest and latest and greatest game makes a pretty big difference, but uh, that's a, uh, that's a stark difference. I think it's just, Unfortunately, with uh, streaming on YouTube, there's a little bit more of that reliance on um, on algorithmic boosts. Oh, come on. Oh, I wasn't ready yet. All right, there we go. There we go. The 
should be one over here. But yeah, I've heard from a lot of people that they specifically... Oh boy. Uh, specifically weren't aware that I had been streaming. Oh, am I still invulnerable? You know, I honestly am not sure if I care. I think this might might be one of those where I'm just kind of like, eh, let's just finish this up. Give me the stream for my sub box. Streams always are at the top there. All right. Ah, there it is. Perfect. Uh, famine. Oh, this is a boss. Not only is it a boss, it's the worst incar incarnation of this boss you could possibly ask for. Not dead yet. Okay, so that's that's the trick. He does, he does actually have an attack. Ow. Piss. Yeah, I probably should try this again. Without, you know, unlimited HP. No, there's a second phase. Let's try this again. Okay, I got it. I think the door's open. I just don't know what weapon I should use. Pistol's probably my best bet. Shit, that's like half of my health in one shot. Oh, right, I still have unlimited mana left. You know what? I don't care. This boss is really hard. Oh, gosh. Oh, no. So you don't have the last of the silvers for a weapon upgrade. I do. You're right. That would have helped.
Oh, I guess I just live down here now. Okay, let's uh let's go get that weapon upgrade. Okay, where am I? I am here. How do we get back? How do we get back easily? I guess we just head to the left. Oh man. I was not expecting to be, like, right at the cusp of finishing this game. Because I was kind of planning on having one more stream of Rusted Moss before I was done. Oh, wrong, wrong layer. Rude. But, I mean, seeing as we're right at the end, I'm just going to push on. I'm just getting wildly overwhelmed here. I was not expecting this... Uh, some of these things to be quite as hard as they were. I knew I was going to be challenged. That was that was a guarantee. Okay, so we have enough for the airship now. I guess there must be other human civilizations if there's an airship. Okay, so that's all of the items found in the area. So we still have potentially one or two items left in the ochre zone. Uh, let's see. If I can actually pick the correct one. There we go. Definitely an experience beating the final boss with only one weapon upgrade. It sounds like hell. Why would you do that? I mean, I understand probably why, but cripes. Let's just go down here. What is this? Where are we going? Wow. Okay. I don't need to be told where the remaining trinkets are. I'm good. I thought I turned flight off. Oh, I turned invincibility off. Oops. Wait. Oh, I see. <laughs> Can't miss. Let's uh, slow it down a bit. Okay, there's another one there. Like I said, I was not quite expecting this game to go full Path of Pain. With all of these things. Dang, I think I need to do it much sooner. Okay, we are safe, we are secure. We have this. We, there's nothing here. 
Have I just been here? Oh, nope. Haven't been here. Yeah, that's probably helpful. Turn flying on. So is that actually it here? Yeah, I guess it's time to head for that boss. Hey, good grief for accessibility options. Uh, thank Gorb for it. I, I would have quit this game. I'll probably like three hours in if it wasn't for them. And it's one of those where like, I will continue to compliment it because effectively it has taken this game from being blisteringly difficult and almost impossible for me or even outright impossible for me to, hey, I actually stand a chance here. There is a question of, let's see, I'm just gonna throw on aim assist. Keep on infinite MP. I'll play at 90%. Oh, I should probably almost consider the range upgrades. Ow. Ow. Yeah, let's just die. Oh, yeah, I took take like three damage here. Okay, trinkets. Let's get rid of the damage fairy. It's not that helpful. Maybe Fae of Love. Get rid of the magnet. Get rid of the trinket. I don't I don't know what that trinket does. It's probably useful. Might have been useful in in fights against Maya, or it's useful in the end of the game. Oh, what are my accessibility settings? 90%. Okay, good. Ow. Yeah, so I'm reasonably okay in this section. And that extra... Oh, wow. Auto-aim is uh, really nice. Ow. That sucks. Okay. Now, unfortunately, I don't think it is... Yeah, it's no longer going in a pattern. It's now actively chasing me. Oops. There we go. Is that it? That actually wasn't so bad. Once I had the uh, uh, infinite range pistol, it was a lot easier. Thank you for freeing me. I hope my other friends are safe as well. I'll go and find them. After all, our Queen Titania still needs us. Okay. What's our last trinket? Incendiary Essence. Ooh, that sounds useful. And that's it for this region. So all we have left is whatever's... Uh, why does she have... She's still got the spider leg thing going on. <laughs> Okay, so let's go back up to 100%, turn these on. So how are we getting down? I guess we go up and over. I guess we should probably go see the tea party before we go too far. As a note fairy, yeah, no kidding. Oops. Uh, let's see. Two more screens over. Three, maybe?
Here we go. Okay, so next order of business, we actually want to go here. Because I want to go see the tea par party, seeing as we haven't seen it yet. Right, it's up here. Nothing better than a cup of burning tea. Kind of a tingling sensation. Yeah, Finn, way to go on the tea. I'm done. Can we get going? We shouldn't keep our lady waiting. Oh, my whole body is tingling with excitement. Let's go, team. Huh. Apocalypse tea time. Does that... If I went back to where Titania is... Would that actually do something? Unfortunately, I don't remember where Titania's head was. I guess let's go check out, check it out, just in case. Okay, it was over here, I think. Yeah, here they are. Ready, guys? Ahem. My lady, we give ourselves to you. Flesh and bone, blood and soul. Our power is your power. Our life is your life. <gasps> A fine meal. I must gather mine strength, for I am but one of ten. Thou wilt collect my pe mine pieces, Fern. I will return when the time cometh. Um. Is that it? I guess let's go down to the sage. And don't save. No, I have no choice. I have to save. Yeah, one more, one more upgrade. And I think I know where it is. Okay, so we're going back down here. Right. I should be over here. Shopkeeper is here. Good, I opened the door. I... I just can't be bothered, man. This looks awful. It's also nothing. Do we have more? We do. Fern's Trinket. I'm sorry. I know I should do these things, but I'm I'm so tired. I am hungry. I'm conserving my strength. And that just looks rough. Because you pretty much have to, like, barely touch anything. Bounce off of it. And some other stuff, like, oh boy. Okay, so what's Fern's Trinket? A drawing Maya made made you as a gift. I guess I'm gonna get rid of the Fae of Love. And Maya's Trinket. I don't know what either of those two do, but I figure wearing them might be good. Okay, uh, let's see. So what are we... What do we have? We have every upgrade, we have every thing. It's time to go. I guess actually, fastest way to get back and out of here is to head for the... Head for the top. I wonder if those fulfill different ending types. Yeah. 
I'm curious about that. Hopefully we still get the ability to see all of them. Hey, you know what I was talking about with fairy rings? We found one. It's this, apparently. Uh, let's save. Go into accessibility. I'm going to keep infinite MP on. Like, I, I recognize I have hit my upper limits. Whoa. I'm not even sure how I'm not getting hit here half the time. Because my damage is really good and some other things are going on. Ow. I think she hit me directly. Yep. Dang it. Troublesome little insects. What? Ow. Cool. But ow. But. I think the big problem I run into with some of these... Ow. Because I wish the charge jump was easier to charge. Like if I could press and hold spacebar instead of down. Because that's not a boost pad there. Oops. Alright. Well, that was much smoother. That was less smooth. Music is cool. Dying is not. Why is everything so dangerous here? Ow. Yeah, I saw that one coming. Ow. That one too. Okay, factory roof. Oh gosh. At least those flowers are kind of working in my favor. Nope. Okay, let's heal. No! Burn! Stay back, Maya. It's over. It's up to you now, Fern. What do you want to do? Huh. Am I going to have to just sit through it? Well, yeah, it looks like we've got four endings here. Power for ourselves, Power with Maya, Maya Wish, and Titania. Are these the four endings? I don't know. Yeah, do we have to redo the boss fight to see all the endings? I'm going to assume the answer is yes. So why don't we go down the list? Whoop! Fern, hand over the pieces. The last time we met, you finally admitted that I was one of the Fae. So why would I listen to you now? I've been thinking, when Alicia accused you of being a changeling, the Coalition tested you for Fae blood. How did you pass their tests? You had no trouble breaking your promises. You were never affected by iron. How? How did a fairy pretend to be so kind to me all those years? I can't believe it. That what we had was just pretend that you didn't care. Even if you're one of the Fae, don't pretend you don't care. 
You know, iron never bothered me. It doesn't affect every changeling. Only those that were never human. It was a long time ago. I was hard to like back when I was a human, and I guess I'm hard to like now. I guess it was unfathomable to the Coalition that a melancholic and annoying child could be just a child? Do you know how many of their own children humans have killed for being suspected changelings? Most changelings don't die in the oven. Their fey parents spirit them away before any real harm comes to them. The Coalition knows that, but they don't care. You're right. I care about you, but all the, all the other humans can go hang. The experiments, the ovens, parents killing their own children because they did not come out the way they wanted. I do care about you, Maya. That's what makes this hard. Fern. I'm sorry, Maya. You don't deserve to live in a world like this. You shouldn't be a part of the Coalition. But you're in luck, Maya. You know Fey politics has one rule. The strongest wins. When the Seer shattered Titania, she actually attained the right to rule. And now I've defeated the Seer. That makes me next in line. Ugh. I'm sorry, Titania, but your power is mine now. I have the power to make the whole world the way I want it. A new queen has emerged. I'm sorry, Maya, but you'll learn to love it here. I know I did. A new era has emerged in Elf Elfame. The Fae are ruled by Queen Fern, the first changeling to rule. Maya expected Fern to make a kinder world, but she soon realized that Fern's morality was more Fae than human. She left Fern's court to seek out mysteri the mysterious changeling king, hoping to learn more about the changeling children who used to be human. Perhaps one day she'll convince Fern to embrace her long-lost humanity, but that might be an age away. That actually wasn't a terrible ending. It wasn't a great one, but I was expecting that to be a little bit more apocalyptic. I need some water. Oh god, my bottle's almost empty. We did not bad. I had an absolute blast with this game. The aesthetic, the music, the, uh... The platforming? Really good. I wish, I honestly wish, there was almost kind of like, um more movement tech that could be unlocked over the course of the game uh, just to make it easier as kind of like a yeah you could do these pure but here's a double jump just to make your life easier because boy by the end of it I was I was just absolutely burnt out on any kind of platforming challenges I will say though some of the best platforming I've ever experienced in a game uh, and someday I should probably sit down and actually play Celeste but I don't know if I'd be able to uh I don't think I'd be able to finish it, to be honest, let alone like any of the harder levels. Whereas this one, the challenge felt mostly right. It's just by the end of it, I was getting kind of exhausted and needed to stop. Okay, so bosses met, maybe all of them? And took me eight and a half hours. Not bad. Difficulty flexible. Oh, right. There was an easier difficulty I could have been on this entire time. Eh, whatever. Okay. This one. Wait, it says 99%. Probably just the endings. Gosh, I hope I didn't miss anything else. Now, is it the same fight again? All right. Ah, uh, can I can I like skip the dialogue? Nope. All right, whatever. You don't know what you've wrought. Die. Ah. Uh. Yes. Stand there and let me shoot you. Oh, this is a joyous occasion. It is I, Fern, Bullet God. Here to smite you for your transgressions and to take, I don't know, my time back. I kind of wish you could actually skip the boss fight if you've already done it. 
I wish there was a cheat code that let me use every weapon at once. That would be like the best shit ever. <laughs> or like unlimited reload speed. Yes, wiggle with me, dance. You don't blink out of existence, therefore I get many gun. Die. Factory roof. Solid ending boss fight though. Rather enjoyed it. Music's also like really solid on this game. I think I did buy the soundtrack for this. I should probably, um, I should probably li give it a listen on its own, now that I'm done with it. I usually don't listen to the soundtrack to games that I've played before, uh, or, sorry, I don't listen to the soundtrack for games that I've, um, I'm in the process of recording because I don't want to get bored of it. Okay, share power with Maya. Burn, hand over the pieces. You know, fate politics is one rule, the strongest wins. When the seer shattered Titania, blah 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 Hail the new queen of Elfame. Hail Queen Fern. Fern, what have you done? You remember this? I drew that for you on your sixth birthday. Everyone was scared of me. Our parents only had had you because all right, our parents only had you because I was too different and too strange. Not lovable or a cheerful child. When you came around, I thought that was it, that I'd be alone and you'd be the golden child. In some ways, it would make my mission easier, being ignored, being unloved. But you never left my side. But you said I was your sister no matter what. That we'd be together no matter what happened. And almost forgotten. Vern, you did this. You destroyed our family. You were right, Maya. We are sisters. But sisters never felt farewell in Elfame. What are you going to do to me? I'm going to protect you. More than that, I want to be by your side again. Fern, this isn't right. This isn't what I want. You can't just abandon all humans because... Just because I'm all you care about. Come with me and we'll be queens of Elfame. Ruling side by side. Take my hand and we'll share the power of Titania. This... That isn't Fern. She was always just a changeling, pretending to be human. She was born to destroy humanity. I was just too blind to see it. But I do have a real sister, the one who whisked away... The one whisked away by the Fae and replaced with, with that changeling. My real sister is somewhere in Elfame, and I will find her. Maya accepted Titania's power, but refused the throne, leaving Fern alone to rule. Trapped in an unfamiliar realm, her sister... The queen of the people that destroyed humanity. Maya ventured into the Timeless Lands, hoping to find her original human sister. Perhaps together, they could restore humanity to its rightful place. Well, that was actually really depressing. <laughs> okay, can we not skip the credits? Oh, that's unfortunate. I wonder if there's more endings than the ones that I'm seeing here. Yeah, those, both of those endings kind of set up a Maya focus sequel, which could actually be kind of cool. The idea of um, exploring kind of a more Fae, like an even more Fae world. I don't know. I think it'd be cool. Oh, there's another boss fight for the conclusion of Nell and Eli's quest line. Oh. Where's that? I mean, we'll see the rest of these endings, but, um... What have I missed and where? Because, yeah, the problem is, as far as I can tell, it's not on the map. Which means I'm kind of... okay. Map is saying Eli should be in Barrow's ceiling, or you need to interact with him to unlock it. Okay. I guess let's go do that and then go get the remaining un endings. It looks like I am missing maybe one room. But where? Map, Barrow's ceiling.
Sparrow sealing the probably the Iker E zone. Okay, let's go to the quarry. I'm just gonna leave all these on at this point. Okay. Shouldn't be anything else over here. Yeah, we'd seen Eli somewhere around here. Yeah, there they are. Mmm. Nell in the factory roof, lake, and then living quarters. Eli in the flatlands lab, then barrow ceiling. Yeah, but where would the boss be? Because I think I've talked to Nell all three times as well. Or maybe I'm missing one. Oh, that's, that's where Nell might be. Maybe I've only actually talked to Nell twice. Okay, oops. Almost missed that one. Okay, so we are, we need to go to the forest cafe. Actually, might be better in the pipe. Wait, top of Elflame in the room to the right of the last trinket. Okay, I'll go check that, but I, there might be one more room to talk to Nell in. That I missed. Because I'm see seeing there's maybe a, th a third Nell dialogue over here. Yeah, there they are. Nobody said said I had to be working all day. In my free time, I like to find old forgotten fairy tales. This is the first half of the story about Shenkin, a young man who was captivated by a fairy's melody. He lay down to listen to it. When the music ended, he realized the tree he was resting under had grown old and tall. Though the music only seemed to last minutes, he was listening to it for decades. The time in Elf Elfame and its surroundings passes strangely. All that time when I was telling stories to you and Maya. Did you already know them? The Vey have... Fae have stories about the same events, but our versions are very different. Okay, so now we've talked to Eli the third time. So, now hopefully the boss fight is unlocked. Funny. Alright. I guess let's go back to the fairy ring, because I probably just go up from there. So top of Elf Flame in the room to the right of the last trinket. Uh which is the last last trinket. Oh, that one. So the room of Oh, that weird empty room that I was confused about. Oh, what is the fastest way for me to get there? Actually to go back up. And then drop. Unfortunately, I don't think I'm going to try on this one. Like, we have, we have hit probably cap. Eh, I could try it. I don't know. I'm very lazy. I'm very hungry. It's like almost 9 o'clock, and I really should have made dinner like two hours ago. But, unfortunately, I'm kind of in that uh, stinky position where it's just like, oh, but I could finish the game tonight. And that's what I'm going to do. Yeah, here it is. Oh, we should probably wait a smidge longer. Is 
is a very at the very least let's go here okay accessibility settings invincibility and flying off i'll give it a shot but with boosts there you are traitor i was wondering if you fell into a hole or something you were always the clumsy type i was starting to get worried something might have happened but i never thought you'd be foolish enough to hide an elfame leave me alone now i'm not on anyone's side not anymore there are better things to do at the end of the world you can't run from your own side. Most fairies would love to see a scientist dead. Right, Fern? Don't bring me into this. Fern, don't let her take me. I should be able to choose my own path. It's the end of the line, Eli. Deserters get what's coming to them. Seems those two are those two are gonna be focused on fighting each other. Maybe I could mess one of them up while they're not while they're busy fighting. <laughs> Sounds like fun. I wonder who should win, Eli or Nell. Uh Ow, rude. And I'm dead. <laughs> yeah, don't worry. We'll go see the other endings. Why are my homing bullets dog shit? Give me a second. I think I need to die. I think auto-aim and the homing bullets are not working at all. But yeah, that's too much damage. I don't feel like it. I'm sorry. I'm not that sorry. I think they're both se secretly trying to kill you. Yeah, no kidding. Seem to really hurt now. Well, I tried my best, but couldn't hit her for some reason. Stay down. You're coming with me, traitor. No, I don't want to help the coalition anymore. Who said anything about help? I have other plans for you. Thanks, Fern. If they really are as capricious as they say, helping humans while hurting them. Are you doing all this for fun or just because you don't care? But don't take this to mean I owe you any favors. Uh, let's, uh, go back out and let's do the other one. Oh, you're locked into the one that you hurt first. I swear I shot her. All right, accessibility, oh. Reloading the game actually turns off everything. All right, whatever. We. I. I can't hit her. Okay, there we go. I, I can't hit Nell. I wonder if it's the um, aim assist screwing me over. Yeah, she just doesn't take any damage. Actually, I'm not sure if either of them are taking any damage. Oh, there we go. It's fine. Finally, I'm free. I'm gonna grow tomatoes now. That's it. I'll find her again. She went deeper into elf Elfame. Are you sure you want to? Whatever it takes. Huh. Wait. Where would she be? Um. Well, that's inconvenient.
It could be sequel stuff. She could be in here somewhere. Wait, wrong direction. Okay. Who's over here? Did I talk to this fairy? Has the barrier retreated? Okay. Wait. Some horrible machines came into Elfame. Nope, that's it. Wasn't a weird empty room in Elfame? Elfame? Yeah, we already got that one, though. Unless it's, like, another ending. Let me look it up real quick. Eli. Is there anything more? Is there anything else or is that it? It looks like that might just be it. I'm not seeing anybody else saying anything. You're still going? About to finish. Again. Uh, uh, we still don't really have any kind of thing about Puck apart from him betraying us. Well, it's fine. I'm just going to stand here. Seems like the best thing I could do in this situation. There we go. No, keep, come back. Keep doing that, that pattern. Yes, just like that. Stand on me. Fight me, Sia. Hug me. And die. Oh, you can actually see how many health bars there are. I never noticed that, but there's a skull with a number above it. <laughs> These are the same guys who made Momodora. Uh, they are not, actually. There's there's definitely a lot of inspirations, but I, I believe this is a totally new developer. And this is like their first game. I don't see anything about tomatoes, though. Oh, grant my wish. Fern, hand over the pieces. You remember when we were children and we exchanged gifts on my sixth birthday? Yeah, I drew that picture to show you'd always be my sister, no matter what our parents said. And you gave me that, uh, art? I was six. Okay, but you weren't really. Aren't you actually, like, centuries old? And you made macaroni art? It's the highest form of art. Okay, Fern. Huh. That doesn't matter anyway. What I'm trying to say is, you give me a gift, and I return the favor. Thanks for being my sister. For being good to me. For this, I'll grant you a wish. Titania's pieces hold enormous power. Wish for anything, and it'll be granted. Anything? Alright, Fern. I wish for humanity to come back. And to never see you again. Ha ha ha! Humans never learn, uh, never learn to be careful what they wish for. Every wish has a price. A human tribute for the, human tribute for the age of men to continue. I wonder if Maya knew. Because of Maya's wish, the Fae accepted Maya as a tribute from the humans, taking her away in exchange for returning to their world. The rust receded, the moss dried up. Humanity was restored, the age of men renewed. And to respect her sister's wish, Fern stayed in the human realm. Never to see Maya again. Wow, that sucked. That was actually the worst ending. Bring back the humans. Also, screw you, sis. I did. I. 
<laughs> Why was the first one, the one that I thought was going to be the worst ending, where we become the Fairy Queen? Like, I thought ascending to power was going to be the worst ending. And the answer is no. That's like, so far been, by and far, the best ending we've encountered. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> I think that was the worst ending. Like, the previous one was kind of sad, but in a, like, all right, whatever way. This one was just sad in a, like, holy shit, that just sucked ending. Like, I get it that Maya did some, like, kind of eh things, but... Cripes? Elle's grumpy at me. She's glaring at me. She's full on glowering as she's making dumplings and looking at me resentfully. There's a pout. Oh, she's pouting harder. I didn't know she could do that. All right, last one. Holy smokes, I am ready for this game to be done. Enjoyable, but I kind of wish I didn't have to refight this here every single time. Like, I don't mind it, but it's... Gosh. Oh, right. Let me guess. Reset all of my accessibility options. All right. There we go. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, last ending. Free me from this torment. I wish to go! I don't want to be here anymore! The devs, if you're listening, please just make it so that, like... There's a glowy portal that just warps you to the ending. This is a cool boss fight, but I don't really want to do it multiple times. Gosh. And I, this is me with... Well, actually, no, like, I did clear it the first time. Even without healing myself too much, I don't think. Or straight up make it so that, like, beating the game unlocks the mystery seventh gun that is literally just the golden gun from, um... Uh... It's the golden gun from... Goldeneye? That just one-shots anything, so you just blast her. I'm like, okay, maybe it just takes off, like, a quarter of her health bar, but make it real fast. I guess here's a question. How much damage does the sniper do? I mean... That's... That's some damage right there. Oh, that was it. Alright, last ending. Unless there's a secret fifth ending that I don't know about. Summon Titania. I like how my uh, <laughs> targeting reticle is still going. I'll unite the pieces and summon Titania. No! Uh, I can't let you do that, Fern. Puck, what are you doing? Take the pieces, absorb them for yourself. Do whatever you want, Fern. Just don't bring Titania back. She's the one who made me this way. After Maya shot us with that big beam, I started to remember my past. It was a long time ago. I came to Titania with a wish. A bargain. Get back the sister I gave away. Oh. Oh. The sister. But, but that means... It can't be. It's you. How dare you. I would have left you back in the lab if I knew it was you. I knew you would have. I don't understand. How do you two know each other? Did you ever wonder who your sister was, Maya? She's lived a, such a long time. Did you ever wonder what she did before she met you? We grew up together. She wasn't called Fern then, of course. She was... I can't remember. I can't even remember my sister's name. Did you give up your name to the Fae? Or is it just the effects of time? I was called Robin back then. And I was the beloved child of the Fae. My village loved me too. I was the perfect child. Polite, clever, funny, modest, all at once. Fern, on the other hand... She wasn't well-liked. She was moody and rude, with a face that was always dirty from whatever escapade she got up to. She held grudges easily and was as cruel as only a child could be. 
I mean, she was a kid, and she was my younger sister, and the most important thing in the world to me. I loved her. Nobody in the village, even her own parents, considered her my sister. As time passed, my village grew more afraid of the Fae. They said the age of men was ending, and the Fae would return. Sound familiar? It's a cycle, the ages of men and Fae. Each has happened before and will happen again and again. My village didn't know I was friends with many of the Fae. The Fae loved children, and they especially loved me. When the Fae started coming into our world, the Fae could not bear to see me upset. They offered me a deal, the continuation of the Age of Men in return for my most precious treasure. So one day, you told me we had to leave the village, that the people there hated me, that we would be together, and you would protect me. You said we were leaving on an adventure. I took Fern with me to Elfame, in exchange for leaving humanity alone. You abandoned me! I gave my little sister to the court. King Oberon, ruler of Elfame, and all of the Fae was ecstatic to receive such a precious gift. What do you think of this story? The prophecy referring to the beloved child it was talking about you. The prophecy had already come to pass centuries ago. Our fight is hopeless. I fulfilled the prophecy to perfection. Then I ruined it all. King Oberon must have known I could not bear to be apart from my sister. They knew I'd break our bargain. In my village, I lived for a few years without Fern. Eventually, I knew I had to get her back. I couldn't be the perfect child my village expected me to be. I shouldn't have to make these sacrifices to save everybody's way of life. Well, I'm the only one to suffer. Nobody was sad to see Fern gone except for me. And I realized that I was the only one there for her. She only had me, the one person in the world who loved her. I went back to Elfame to find Fern, to plead to the court to give her back. King Oberon had changed his name and form, as he does often. She started going by Titania, and before as Mab the Mother of Dreams, as Nicknaven, and thousands more. Queen Titania said no human breaks a vow to the Fae, but since I was their beloved child, she'd make an exception, to, exception for me. We would play a game. If I could convince Fern to come back with me, she would let us go freely. If not, well, I knew it would be something bad. So for the first time since I gave her away, I talked to my sister. It was only a few years for me, centuries had passed for her. Fern looked exactly as I remembered her, but her eyes were hard. She didn't recognize you? It'd be better if she hadn't. All I saw was that she hadn't forgiven me. Though every Fae I know changes like water down a stream, Fae was the same. She- uh, Fern, sorry. She was an eternal child, with a personality of unyielding iron, and she only saw me as the one who had betrayed her. Even after centuries, she had not forgiven me. I begged her to come away with me. I told her all of my regrets and how guilty I felt for giving her away. I begged her. She turned from me as the fairies dragged me away. As a penalty for losing the game, Queen Titania cursed me. She stripped me of my form and my name, and banished me from the court. I remember it all, my body falling apart piece by piece, until, until I became this ball of a shadow. A lowly fey creature. No longer beloved by anyone. This is what the Fae do to those they love. Centuries passed. No one would help me or even look at me. Not even my so-called friends. No one would go against the Queen. There was only one way to reverse the bargain. Seed a new ruler of Elfame. And that's when I found Titania's sister. The seer. She was living in a cave high in the Blue Mountains, watching the rest of Elfame with hate and envy. She told me she'd break Titania's curse, if I helped her. She told me I'd be able to see Fern again. For the first time in a long time, I felt hope. I could talk to Fern again, as a stranger. Perhaps I could change her mind about her older brother. I messed up when I was captured by the Coalition. You know the rest. For a time, I lost my memories. But even after I remembered my past, I couldn't tell, tell her who I was. Fern's eyes were the same. I could tell she never forgot, and she would never forgive me. You were with me, for the, uh, with me the whole time, lying to me. You're the one who hasn't changed. You don't know what it's, what's best for me or what I want. And what I want is those pieces you stole. You'll have to catch me first. Where am I? Fern, the beloved child has brought his grudge upon us. Robin, he abandoned me. I hate him, I hate him. I don't want any of this. I just want to go home. Child, all can be the way it once was. You need only unite my pieces. I will use my remaining magic to grant you a blessing, one familiar to you. 
I've stolen back a part of me from my beloved child. Use it. Take my eye and set things right. Your weapons cannot harm him, but you can outlast him. Distract him, child, while I take my power back. And then? And then back to fair Elfame, where we shall meet by moonlight and bask in joyous dreams once again. Oh no, we have another boss fight. What? Fern, what happened? Are you alright? Titania's eye, I can feel its power. Forget all that, Fern. Puck's too powerful for you to fight. Without Puck, you can't even use your hook. You hurt what he did to me. I'm just glad I can return the favor. Besides, with this eye, it has the same grapple hook blessing as Bonnie gave Puck, but a thousand times stronger. I can throw my hook as many times as I want. Please, it's too dangerous. Don't do this, Fern. You're not going to stop me? I've never been able to stop you. forgot I can fly. Um, let's turn that off, just because this is actually kind of interesting without it. Yeah, I'm just gonna disregard that. Okay. I guess let's... You'd think with unlimited grappling hook. This would actually be easier. It is not. Oh, hello. Uh, let's see. Well, we've done all that. As dear sweet brother. How did you get here? I had a little help from the queen. Titania. Still screwing things up for me. You're the one who screwed things up. You abandoned me. You're the reason I am this way. I came back for you. It's too late now. Give me Titania's pieces or I'll take them from you. I don't want to fight you. I just want you to listen to me for once. But if this is the only way you know how to do things, so be it. Oh. Um. <laughs> ah. Here's the thing. I, I'm sorry. At this point, we are just in... Wander has checked out, and it is now just kind of fun time to do tricks in the gra with grappling hooks. I don't know. We- oh my god. I'm- no kidding. I- I'm not even sure if I could do this if I wanted to. Like, this is impressive? Cheese the fight. Well, I can't hear him, is the answer. Like, this is literally just a survival fight. Like, all of the previous endings... Well, okay, so the first ending, which I said was kind of the one of the better endings, uh, I think that was the only ending available to you if you don't have any of the other... Uh, if you don't have any of the perks, the mech, or any drawing or anything. I've had enough of this. If you'll never listen to me, I'll make you understand. Rude. Maya, no! You killed her! No, that beam was meant for you! And you know I'd never hurt you. It was just a spell to make you see things my way. Looks like I have more... have a more obedient sister now. 
Maya. We. You can't touch me. I'm too bouncy for you. We. Also invulnerable. <laughs> oh. I do more damage based on grappling around? But like, cripes. I, I, I don't think I'd want to do this. At first I was like actually kind of sympathetic to Puck. I'm not anymore. Puck kind of sucks. Oh my god. What are you even supposed to do about that? Like, I'm gonna have to watch somebody do this the right way. Because, like, there is nothing. There's no way I could have done this. I mean, maybe I could have, but, like, cripes. Fern, how could you? I stood up for you and no one else did. You gave me away. It was for the good of mankind to protect our village, our family. Our village, our family, they were cruel to me. Yes, but just to you. They were good people otherwise. Leave us alone. Doesn't this prove how much I loved you? The Fae would only take the most precious gift of their beloved child. It had to be you. I didn't give up our village. I gave up my sister. More precious to me than anything else. Leave us alone. Queen Titania, please. With these pieces, I restore you. I do appreciate that final ending, though. I am restored. Spirits, sprites, sylphs, pixies, pucks, and pans. Your queen is returned. This land is now ours. Our age has now begun. But first, my changeling, speak with me. My lady. Dear changeling, thou repaired mine flesh and summoned me whole. My own sister would not do so. Even my most beloved child never forgave the fay. I shall grant you a wish and consider your actions repaid. Tell me, changeling, what is thy will? I... I wish... I wish I had my sister back. Once upon a time, a compassionate girl named Fern made the choice to return the Queen of Fairies back to her throne. Fern was brave and kind, clever and forthright. And she had a sister she loved, who shone just as bright. With the Fair Queen back on her throne, fairies big and small returned to the world, and witches lurked in the deep dark woods. Mystery and wonder returned to the realm, while humans scuttled like insects back to their shoddy homes, horseshoes fearfully hung on their rickety doors. Milk was once again left out for their fair subjects of the Queen. Soon, all that remained of the, a remained of the age of men and the human's metal world were mere stories. But it is said that a shadow still lurks in the deepest of the forest, waiting for his sister to come home. Yeah, probably the best ending. Because all the other ones involve uh, Fern and Maya. It was Maya, right? Um, separated and kind of sad. The first one wasn't terrible, but it wasn't great. Um, so is Puck the weird shopkeep? I think that was actually supposed to be... Um, I think that was supposed to be Titania. But I could be wrong. I don't know. What a fantastic game, though. Had, a, had an absolute blast with this one. I will definitely ugh, take a break before I do another YouTube stream of this length. Or next time bring Shell along so she can actually hang out and chat with me. She is now sadly pout again. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, absolutely incredible Metroidvania. I play a lot more than I would, would expect, and this is probably one of the hardest ones to the point where I'd... If it didn't have the accessibility settings, I never would have been able to beat this game, especially that last ending. Like, maybe I could have suffered through it, but it would have taken a lot of tries and frustration and a bunch of other things. I just... I kind of find that I just uh, goofed through it instead. Uh, but boy... Props to anybody who can get through this entire game without touching the accessibility settings. Especially on a harder difficulty, because I think there is one that is even higher. Oh, but, with all that said, for now, thank you all so much for watching. I'll see you next time.
And yeah, serious, seriously, good luck if you're planning on playing this game and giving the uh, last boss a shot yourselves. As cripes. But anyway, it is far past time for me to stop. So, see you tomorrow. Or whenever I stream. I, I'm probably not going to stream tomorrow. I don't know what my plan is going to be. I know Shell and I want to get back through um, Mage Seeker. So that'll probably be next on the docket. And we're going to try and get through that before Jedi Survivor comes out. Because I think we're going to want to stream that one this weekend. So anyway, goodbye. And see you whenever. I guess pay attention to Discord. That's where I announce all my streams.